What's good? What's good? But what's good, homies? What's good, cowboy? What's good, Obi, Dina? What's good, everybody? Just about to eat some drink. Yeah, I, uh... Um... Raid for Thunderstorms to hit. Oh, it's storming out there? in the statue. Let's see if I got it. Yeah, codes like crazy. Paul, you decided to start on your laptop. Phone was dying, trying to run the game. I feel you, bro. Oh, it's over the limit. Hold on. Um, wow. I don't like how it's... <sighs> don't you guys getting some big storms, ATN? Oh, okay. Yeah, we... I don't think we're storming for us right now. Got her character. Brilliant spark. Where'd I get this from? Oh, well. Got that for... What I hate. <laughs> Yo, let's get going in. Doing some homework for a while. Uh, oh, for uni while watching? Yo, nice, nice, nice. Yo, we're close to getting our character over here, guys. All excited? Okay, so let's let's let everybody see the team. So this is our squad. All right, so we got Cecia, 
And what do you CC is the Supreme. Uh, we have Viprian on there because he matches, but he's obviously not our best. We got Thorin. Supreme Plus. Coco's Legendary Plus. And Smokey is Legendary. Um, so we've been... We've been building to these. I've been trying to build up Merrily. Top out in raids. I've been trying to get some Corins. I've been slagging on the Kruger, I know. But, uh... Got Brutus, we got helicopters of Nero and all them. So Please say this is PTR. Right. No, this is not PTR. This is not my PTR account. I've actually surpassed my PTR account. Um, yes, okay, so he's legendary now. Nice. Nice, 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 nice. What are you doing with two sprints? <laughs> Coco's in PTR, actually. Coco is in PTR. Uh, but no, I got... Uh, I got lots of copies of the same two. Pretty much. Like, I... I haven't gotten many copies of other heroes. I just like my list is I don't know, my list is kind of small, but I don't have a lot of people. Like I'm still missing a lot of heroes. I just got the same copies of the same people. Like it's literally just what happened. I keep getting very spread out copies. I hate it. Yeah. Like I keep like I've <laughs> like I've literally just been getting back to back Thorans. It's easiest. Current pulls are so scuffed. <laughs> Great, it's not just gonna be bad. Yeah, the PTR is a regular game now, Obi. It's regular. Like, I can go make a account in that server now. Thorin keeps avoiding me like the plague, and I keep switching up my baller A rig list. Yeah. Um, let me see. Yeah, so we're on AFK 393. Doing some decent progress there. Uh, the boss, this one I just don't have an account made for it. It's whatever. But, um, you know, we've been decent on the others. We're 55, 30... 70 but as long as lucky uh the lucky guild is up there that's all that matters we got jink turtle zarin yeah so jink zarin turtle and snow stomper i don't think they have the accounts like for it but i i'd be struggling on this boss because, like, of the silence and stuff, I just don't have really an account, like, heavily made for it. Unfortunately. I'm sitting here trying to think. He's gonna be on the outside of the heel, though. Yeah. I gotta set them different. I was trying to, like, he getting hard character. Yep. Hell yeah! <laughs> what are you talking about? I was gonna. What? I see. 
Nero Tech, I tried, but <sighs> I've been using Nero actually though. I've been using him a lot. Okay, so we can break a hundred. We're at ninety-one. Bow before the king. Bow before the king. Yeah, we can do it. Yo, let's see if we can get Nero in there, bro. I respect me some Nero. Oh yeah, what if he runs up behind? Yeah, what about that? Oh, but Thorin gets pushed out. Nero just blinked away. There was one case case stage where he was beating the brakes off me, but it was doing stupid damage for no reason. Yeah, he does a weird amount of damage at times. Yeah. Alright, yo, we got this, bro. Let's actually add somebody serious. Okay. Um What a tough fight. Let's go. Oh my god, he got smacked. No, we're getting smacked. All right, there we go. We don't have a unit that grants immunity, do we? No. Coco gives us that great, like, reduction, right? But yeah, no immunity. Yo, I need a heal before we die. Please. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. No, no, no! Come on, we're so close, dude. Now, the king. Yo, it's good, Kai. You're an elite plus, she's not really carrying me in a lot of stages. Throw the next shackle to Nero. Igor behind Nero, Nero immediately ults. Igor, throw the shackles to Nero and add a healer like K1. An unkillable setup, MGP setup. Yeah, Coco's insane, bro. I told y'all about Coco. Y'all do so much damage. Coco is crazy, bro. Coco is absolutely crazy. Follow me. 
Oh my gosh, she almost got one shot. Okay, but we're going. We're doing good. We're doing good. The. I feel like the faction bonus is worth like 50% of the time. Like my current team, I'm using a fish constant, doesn't use one, but I guess that's just me. Uh, some. Sometimes you can go without it. You, sometimes you can't go without it. But it really depends. Wow. It really depends. Like, sometimes the, the buff helps out. It doesn't like. Um, but, like, see here, we got less damage. So we didn't, you know, we didn't live as much. We didn't have as much attack, right? So I mean, we're just trying anything, right? But yeah, yo, darkest hour. Thank you for the follow. Hey there. Oh, oh, I do have the wrong one. That's why ain't nobody watching me. Oh, if you wanted me to look at your account, uh, hop into the Discord. You can do AFK help. Um, and you can do... Uh, just post screenshot. Just post screenshot. We'll look at it. We'll talk about it. Yeah. Exclamation Discord. With the AFK, AFK journey help. We'll do that. Unable to defeat AFK stage 600. Okay. Let me beat this boss and then I'll look at that. I guess we'll do Viperion for now. Yo, it's good, Black Hat. What's my go to tank for each stage? Thoran. Thoran's our go to tank. Thoran is so goaded. These are going good, bro. We streaming, we chilling. Getting back to some AFK. Ooh. Okay. 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 We're hitting new damage. Please, no! Bro, the snowman! Oh, we're so close. We're so close. Okay. Can we survive this? Should have had ODEX. I know. I know. Post my account in the AK help. Any chance you can have a look? Yeah, I'll look at it right after this. I'm trying to hit a hundred percent real quick. No, no, no. There we go. There we go. There we go. Come on, come on, come on. You got this. Oh, come on, come on. Oh, we got it. We got it. We got it, baby. I thought... I thought we didn't get it. I thought we didn't get it. All right, let's get Darkest Hour. Need help for his Snow Stomper? He's kicking my ass. Ooh, okay. So Thoran, 
or granny are pretty good because they have self-healing, right? So uh, I put out a video on my channel and you have a lot of the characters here, right? So granny or Thorin are really good characters to use for um, that raid. I would say that when it comes to your healer, you were pretty much forced to use Coco, I mean, uh, Haywin. So I'd probably go the granny route that way you have your wilder bone uh you can get closer to your wilder bonus um now the unfortunate thing is that you have a lot uh mm. kruger's really good for the defense buff Odie's really good for this boss as well But Kruger being in the front probably won't survive because of the lack of healing if you like without the high investment. Cause I mean I literally just use Thorin. I mean mine are leveled though. But I literally just use Thorin, Cecia. Viperian, Odie, and Smokey. Like, you could technically throw in Haywin into that same team, but I don't think... I mean, I obviously know it won't go as well. Because, um, I mean, this boss is a little tough. But, like... If you're going the wilder route, it would be Granny, Haywin... You don't have Parissa level. I'd say... Uh, I would have said Parissa, but you don't have her level. I mean, you could probably take... Why don't you try Granny, Haywin... Damien for some, for some survivability. And then Rock... Merrily and Odie. The two healers, the two healers, one tank, two DPS should be able to help you out. Should be able to help you out. But you probably won't rank really high because like you need high investments into uh your basic attacker rangers. Do really well in this like it this is like probably like my worst boss like ever i hate this boss currently stage 58 but worried about having two teams of 700 when my other units aren't so powerful i love the team I'm currently using we're not sure who to prioritize for a second team oh is this your team here Um, let's see. Ooh, the Tim Jesus, you got Timesia? It's a lot of investment into her. Um, my thoughts are having a second team as Odie, Smokey, and Sandra, Coco, and Rainier. I like doing... I like, I'm personally like a Graveborn Mauler Chaz. Uh, like, um, and a friend in the guild, he's a, we use like for a lot of raids or other teams. Like I like using Thoran, Cecia, Coco. Oh, you don't have Smokey. I usually use Smokey. Because Coco isn't that great of a healer. I'd probably make a second team. Uh, oh, you have like a bunch of these wilder units. Granny. I just realized you have a bunch of wilder units. You have Granny. Haywin. Oh, you do have Smokey. He's right there. Jesus, I missed him. I missed him. Jeez, you have so many units, bro. Hold on. 
So you said you like this team. Currently stage 558. What about having two teams? Well, your Smokey's higher invested. So I would definitely say... Oh, you did say Smokey. Odie? She said Odie, Smokey, and Tondra, Coco, and Rainier. The only thing with that team... I mean, you'll have the survivability. But, like, Odie without, like... High investment, I feel like you might not do the damage that you're looking for. But Coco is a really great unit. Smokey is a really great unit. Rainier is a really good unit with, like, uh, Mythic Plus. So, I say... So I say go Wilder. I say go Wilder, Graveborn. Because you can do Granny as your frontline tank. Smokey. Granny, Smokey. Rainier. And then if you do want to go Odie, I'd probably pair him with Laika for the extra attack speed buff. And they would kind of sit in the back and nuke everything down. Uh, if you get your Haywin up, Haywin's going to be also really good. Oh shit, but you're in Tantra's Mythic. Yeah. Yeah, go your route. Yeah, go your route. You have high invest. Uh, you have high investment to those two units. I did all that planning for nothing. I didn't realize you're in Tondra. bro. How you get? How you get her myth? How you get her mythic, bro? I wish I had her that high. You literally didn't mean to have her in the wish list. I was like, yo, Overzealous was good, bro. I literally, like, I I don't know anybody who has an Entendre that high. I was impressed. So, yeah, bro. I mean, I guess, yeah, like, you're going with Entendre, Smokey. You're kind of going with the team that you want. Uh, you can probably take off Coco if you feel like uh, you don't need the extra survivability. But I know Entendre's not the highest tank, but, like, yeah, Rainier will help out with Odie, so yeah. I say that team for sure. That's a five man buff. Yeah. You could probably go that team. Coco's definitely worth the investment though. Koki uh Koki. Odie Odie and Coco are worth the investment for sure. I would try to invest a little more into Haywin though. She's a really top tier healer. She's really good. Really, really good. Also Kruger too. You want to get Kruger up. Kruger's good for raids. Behold the insane cope of my spread. This is Gordon. Holy crap. He do you do have a spread. Oh my god. You're so spread out. Dude has every unit in the game. You have, like, yeah, you have units I literally just don't have. This man. <laughs> if you want more damage, well, if you want more damage, um, since you'll already have a four buff on Mauler, you can put in um I mean your only other I mean your only options really is like 
Laika uh, to help out with Odie. Laika or Parissa. Viperian, Laika, or... Uh, yeah, Viperian, Laika, or Parisha. <sighs> For, like, some AoE. I mean, there's Arden, too, but I see that these characters are a little higher invested. Right? There's also uh, Mir whatever uh, Mario for the ult, but yeah. Vela. You got the Vela, you got the... Oh, you got a, quite a bit of units level. You got Granny and Smokey up there. But y'all got such great units. Yo, this man got the Mythic Kruger. Jealous, Mythic Viperian. Jealous. I like this. Was a good account. You have a lot of uh, you have a lot of meta units. Uh, Corin is a meta unit, really good. Kruger's meta unit for raids. Marily, you're probably trying to get some copies for her, but you went in. The others like they're really all good, but Marily's really good for raids. Don't forget about Odie. Coco's good for if you're lacking. This dude got a Dianel already. All right, y'all are on different leagues, bro. My ask. Vela skin was free in PTR. Vela skin, I don't even remember it being a thing in PTR back when they started because Vela was just a regular character. She was literally just a regular character. Let me do these real quick. Do you need, do you need two teams at 700? Um, I haven't heard about two teams at 700. Uh, could be a thing. I haven't gotten up that high. And... Gordon, did you hear about that? Yes, two teams at 700. Ah! Do you need multiple teams after 700? Some stages will have two parts. Hey, bro. That's whale territory. I haven't been there yet. Y'all in a whole nother world. I knew that there was the content after 11... What is it? 1100? After AFK stage 1100? But needing two teams at 700 is wild. Wow. Same as Tower of God and some guildmates confirmed it. Okay. I'm not even going to make... There's not even a way to like to make content for that, bro. I was gonna be like, yo, good luck. You are beyond what I can do. Yeah, it's pretty far. It seems like that's standard procedure for these new auto gouches. Yeah. How important would you guys say Epic Plus versus Legendary Mythic is at like early on? Like ASH 230? Uh yeah, 230, you really wanna like have like a mythic and stuff built. Like, um, yeah, at those stages you want to have a mythic. Like, unfortunately, like I told a lot of people, like, uh, this isn't, um, oh, well, I'm in the 700s. This isn't like R99 where you can have a copy of every character and feel good. You, you need to focus and make some teams. That way they're invested well, especially if you're free to play. Oh, and if you ever need four teams, I do know you need four teams and that, but I didn't know how much they're gonna carry you for AFK journey. Aside from Coco, Odie, and Kruger, any recommendations for other units to get some hair line up in Discord? Yeah, 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 yeah. See, Thorin, these are all solid. See, these are solid. These are solid. The Seth is like crazy. Uh, I would work up Merrily, Merrily and Coco. Oh, Kruger. Um, well, you can't. You don't have that much space. I would. Mm. Coco really helps me in survivability, especially against like Sky. Uh. Wait, I'm so dumb. Thank you, Gordon. Nah. <laughs> All right. 
so we got Thorin, Cecia, really good, Smokey. Okay, so you got, you literally are running the team we've been talking about, right? So same thing though, Kruger. Kruger and Mel uh, and Merrily, you want to really work up. They're really good for raids. Merrily is like on Odie's level of like basic attacks as at Mythic Plus. She gets uh, true damage. Corrin is sick too. Yeah, but you have uh, really good characters. Like um, in game, Haywin is really good. Um, I hear a lot of things about Kashir. I just haven't used Kashir a lot. I have Kashir on my PTR, but I just didn't. I just didn't really care for Kashir as much. Shakir, I say Kashir. Shakira, Shakira, whatever. But yeah. Like, Snowstopper is probably the only one I'm least prepared for because I have a lot of ulting characters, right? I have a lot of characters that ult, and she cares, uh, and Snowstopper is the one I'm least prepared for. And I know that Merrily is really good there. Um, also, old uh, McCree from Overwatch is really good. Like, just all basic attack characters. Dynel, if you have a Dynel, are really solid. Oh, he went is busted at the high rating. Yeah, he one's amazing. Oh, yo. No, I didn't mean to do that pull. Oh, well, I guess it's worth it. Yo, Coco. No, stop it. <laughs> you see what I mean, bro? I be getting... I be getting these lucky pulls. Like, I always get who I want. I don't know. I don't know why. <laughs> Always get who I want. It's just always focuses the people I need. It's crazy. Are we posting the units? I might need help figuring out the teams if I group bonus group bonuses worth. Uh AFK help. Can't be mad about Coco, no. Bro, I'm getting bodied by stage 269. Might have to send it a proxy. Yo. Yeah. Yo, yesterday, I was doing proxies like crazy because I was just like chilling and I was like, yo, let me get, let me help these people out. Oh, there we go. All right, guildies. Let's go. Obi. Yo, simply squad. Everyone. You're not even worth getting up for. You're not even worth getting up for. Oh, sorry, there's only two. You and Obi are godsends when it comes to proxy. Hey, bro. I, uh, we, we putting the strats up, man. We putting them strats up. Bow before the king. Actually, let me, I don't think I did all the, I don't think I did all the promos, bro. There's like mad promos. Okay, so I use that one. So I'm down to CMK. Okay, did I do them all? Okay. Okay. I might have used up all the press.
Oh, there we go. Even Spinders in general have way more strats they can use. So fun to play with whale accounts. There's so many options. Yeah, I will say when I was cooking with like Turtle's account, dude, Turtle got so many characters, it's wild, bro. I was crazy shit I would not even dream of when he was helping me out. Yeah. You get to sit there with all those options. My OD kind of destroyed the guild boss. Too bad I only had stand for one hit. At fifty percent, already did mine. Yeah. Ooh, before it resets, let me. We're still in a guild boss. Let me swap to. Probably run a life bearer comp. It should be fine enough. Getting Viperion a lot? Same. Viperion be dropping in like crazy. Keep getting Seth and Odie, they love me. Nice to be 269. Yo. Congrats. Congrats, congrats. Yeah, we're almost, uh, oh, so those of you who aren't in the guild, so, yeah, we got, bro, look at all these people, bro. They be so active, man. Uh, so we got our guild chests, got some decent stuff there. Oh, guild wall then changed. We're grim. Turtle Lex. What am I looking at? Turtle. All right, so unfortunately, we were right up under Karatha, even though we were on top of the longest, but they just have like a Crazy, crazy guild, bro. Um, let me see where. Okay. Wow! Daddy, look. Good job. 
How do I, oh, there we go. Yeah, so they've done 580. We're at 373 for number two. Um, but like, I mean, look at their three mil, three mil, three mil, 1.8, 1.5. Like, look at these accounts 1.63, 3.2, 800, 3.1, 2.1, 3.3, .3, 700, 4, 8, 1, 8, 5, 1. 8. Like their lowest people are the four and five hundred thousands, six hundred, seven. Will you see all this? Every single person is a spender. Like they don't know the word free to play at all. They don't. We have over 20 people on our wait list right now, so stay tuned. They have a guild, CLS Cluster Guild. Because CLS has a lot of people. Free to play Andy. A six mil? From PTR? That has to be PTR. If it's, unless it's a joke. It has to be a joke. It has to be a joke. Do we have a Discord? Yeah, exclamation Discord. Exclamation Discord. Sorry, we'll keep you busy with my proxy game fight. Uh, let's see. Did we get any higher? I don't think so. Bro, this snowman is like a boss. I can't beat it. I can't doubt it. It's like a boss. Oh my gosh. There's no way. There's no way. Okay. All right. I know where I stand. I know where I, know where I stand. We gonna stay right where we at. Oh, let me get this. Desk. Yeah, we do both have a desk. Oh my. Looks like someone needs a little. Same time. Oh. Not too late. I can't remember, man. Oh wow, we instant. Yo, we're instant defeating teams like at that level. Yo, we doing good. Like that's global, not PTR. All right, bro. Posted the roster in chat. That's still a really good rank. Yo, thank you, Extrosity. I appreciate it, bro. We working hard, dog. We working hard. Well, that's global. Six mil in global? Bro, I don't even know how... That's thousands, man. That's just... Ooh. See, I've just been living... 
who I see that's good from Turtle in the Guild. What's the focus? All right. Oh, this man just been going for waifus, he said. Um. All right, so you got a Graveborn. You see you're going into Mauler. Odie's the way to go for sure. I would put up some... All right, so the characters that I would say that you probably need to work on, right, to help you out. Coke, like, so literally the people you have in purple. Uh, Merrily, Coco, uh, Kruger, and Corin are really essential raid units, right? Uh, uh, these are really essential raid units. In terms of progression, uh, you don't have Haywin. I would pick up a Haywin. Haywin's a really good in-game healer. Um, Thorin is an in-game tank, so you're good there. Carol uh, Carolina is a really good um, PvE character. CC Cecia, obviously, yes. Uh, using Smokey. I would say that if you're struggling in survivability on stages, that's where I, like, I really use Coco there. Uh, you could try going with Brutus, right? Or uh, Rowan, if you want some extra ults to have Cecilia and Carolina ult quicker. You could put Rowan in to help out. That's where Rowan's pretty good. If you already have the three buff here. Um, you do get Igor. You get a choice of having a copy of Rowan or getting a Igor to help tank. And you can run four Graveborn. So you could run four Graveborn with Smokey for a little bit if you wanted to do that. Igor is really good at hopping around. I made a, I actually put out a video uh, the other day about the Selector. And it's really between Igor and Rowan of what you really feel you want. You feel like you want that second that second um, tank? You can go ahead and go with that. But a lot of people like having the investment into Rowan. But you're doing fine. I'm just saying for rays, let's just get these four here. Corrin, Kruger, Merrily, Coco. Yeah, if you need it, then yeah, go Igor. You get Igor, like, literally at reset. So. Like, now. <laughs> Pretty much. I get Supreme Rowan at reset. Yo, nice. Here's someone saying things like puzzles respawn on the map. Is that true? I've been hearing talks about that too, but I haven't gone back and looked at them. I'll have to see them on the map. Someone said some of them reset. Yeah, but I haven't seen that. Bro, Nero be doing, like, I'm not saying, like, Nero's doing, like, mad damage. But all of a sudden, sometimes he be hitting. Like, Obi was saying, it's like, just every now and then, he be really going in. Yo, we at reset. I'm going to go ahead and get this. Go ahead and get my Lucius. Oh, wait. Yo? <sighs> What's the matter? Perhaps my companion may assist. I didn't want him. It was literally... What's crazy? He was literally right there next to... <sighs> he was right there next to Cece. Yay! Well, we got just in time. Brian, Good. Epic Plus. That's so amazing. It's everything I wanted. Good. That's some progress. You should be grateful. 
Not bad, it could have been worse. I guess it could have been worse. I doing a day late on the service, so I don't get the epic select yet. Oh, dang it. Nier just needs some love, and he's been chilling. Glory expedition has begun. Guild members can obtain honor points for the guild by ranking in various events. With more honor points, guild's ranking will increase, and members will obtain more rewards. Lasts from 14... Oh, it's a whole month. Okay, nice, 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 nice. We got, we got four more days. Oh wait, Battle Joe's like, hey. Decisive victory. we hit rank one at a point it's because we were rank one we played a season challenger during the battle drills so, so we just start recruiting dick flicky yo Yo, we in there, baby. Yo. You could have gotten to me, see your favorite unit. Shut up, Galaxy. I, I really could have. Yo, bro, we ranking out here. Yo, we ranking out here. Yo. Yo, I just got a Roman copy. Not bad. Could have been much worse. Yes, it's true. Finish my design, by the way. But sad, this is no R99 stream. Wait, Lux, you on this too? Oh, yes, Blade. Yes, I be, I be on this game, homie. I finally got a good looking title. We happy? Oh, we looking good. Hope he comes home in the next Ezra Bowl. Yo, we looking good. We looking good. I like it. I like it. All right, let's go ahead and, all right, we got our 400 there. Oh my God, look at the, look at these people. Jink, Cowboy Dan, already got my, oh my. Girls. Didn't really be like, hold my beer. Wait, trying to hit 1.5 mil tonight. All right, so we got, um, no, let's go to our team.
Now let's go. We in love with the go go. Easy, we tank these. We tank these. Yo, look at his damage. Yo, let's go, Dina. They gonna know about the lucky guild. <laughs> oh, no way. We all got white. Oh, come on, bro. <laughs> Rank 12. Come on, come on, come on. We got this. Uh... Ooh, we got Coco. Up. Really? Hmm. Let's see what we can do. They gonna know us in the server, bro. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Who put in that work? CC, of course. Let's go. Epic! See how well we do. Let's see how well we do. We're gonna get Newt first hit. Yeah! Coco carries, though. Guys, Coco carries in this fight. Check out my video. Coco carries. Wanna check it out every Let's go. Here we go. 1.6. What rank are we? What rank we be? <laughs> rank 10 for now. <laughs> we are rank 10 for the time being. <laughs> this is not a permanent spot. Oh, we're rank 11 already. Nice, nice, nice. Wait a minute, what? Leading players. Turtle lags. Oregrim. Oh my gosh, bro.
I earn rank 50. Nice. Who's adding me? Taco? That looks good, but I really like this. I still really like this. Rank in the top 21 to 50. I gotta eat. Gotta rock it while I got it. Rank 1 to 5. No. Where is that? I wonder where this outfit is that they got. And I forgot. Skins. Hmm. All right. We're going to get an S-Rank hero right here. I'm uh calling it. Hopefully. No. Dang it. I meant to say A-Rank. Yo, Corin. Appreciate you. Yo. Okay, hold on. I do need Helen Merrily's. But Merrily's not like. Not that we're close. We're just gonna help frontline too. He's already got coffee though. And I know he's not that good though. All right, let's go. Oh, we got it. We got it early. Welcome to my shop. How can I help you? Hey, yo. We got the Rowan. As we put him on there, we got the Rowan. You see how they try to do you, bro? You try to be great. You try to do right. You see how they do you? They're like... But then they, they hit you with this, bro. 
Because, like, when you get this, like, you know your character, like, was up to legendary. Like, that's that's the part where it got me. But we're not going to do it. So they try to get you, bro. <laughs> nice. Wow, bro. Now spin, buddy. So spin. I can't, bro. I'll be, I don't got it, man. Remember, there's two new characters. Well, not two. But there's new characters coming on R99. The channel does well. And maybe. But we got R99 to take care of, bro. Got yeah, brand new. Inventory, shipments, deliveries. Am I missing anything? Oh yes, gifts for my customers. Looking for me? Oh, <laughs> good day, boss. I'm putting it on a nine looks dope. Yeah, it really does. There's a stage above Supreme. Uh, Supreme Plus. Supreme Plus. Yeah, that. You're the only one who's never betrayed me. We will make them pay. All right, let's progress story. The corrupted route. Reasonably, Iron Man looks dope. It's like the dark forest. Paragon after the Supreme Plus. Season. Oh yeah, 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 Paragon. To Paragon. Yeah, I forgot about Paragon. Looks like you've got a bit of a problem. Will these people affect your plan? What are you so worried about? You were given the power. Just like before. Make sure they don't trouble me. <sighs> hmm. Mere mortal. I'll tolerate you a little longer. CC She looking good. She looking good. <laughs> CC looking good. We beat this. Mm. Potions for sale. 
Buy four, get one free. Well, victory is deserved. The God. I could probably take off. Well, victory is um, Let me see, do I want to, let me see, what if I did take out Smokey for now and put on... Got it. Oh my gosh. Well, victory is deserved. He was doing a lot of damage. I know he's mid, but like Well, just in time. Hmm. Mm, I see. Understood. Thank you. Let's go. I get to flex my shiny title for two weeks. I'm a decisive victor. I know, right, bro? <laughs> Reach level 110. Yeah, trust me, I'd like to. I'd like to. Crystal defense. Got it. Got it.
gosh, we're destroying this. Well, victory is deserved. Yo, Ryan's doing really good. Vela. Hold on. Got it. <sighs> Time for work again. Yeah, there's like no way. You're not even worth getting up for. Hmm. Let's go harvest together. This first eye beam is going to destroy me. Yeah. Without Coco, I just don't live it. Yeah, okay. That's what I thought. But yeah. Got your first Supreme on your account, CC? Yo, congrats, bro. Congrats. Supreme CC is really nice. Right, come on, let's go ahead and die. Go ahead and take me out. Thank you. Yeah. You have to. At least at my level, like, you have to, Coco. Coco's like the only way to live this thing. We got over here. Yu's healing is always interesting. Always interesting to me. Let's take CC out of my epic creative now. Not really worth having her on there. I'll have her on my normal wishes and get her from Arena Sword. Exactly. When you get her up to that, like yeah, the two copies, like just you know, just wait. You'll get her. That's what I did. That's why I took her off, because I was like, I just need two more copies. I'll get her from Arena. Speaking of Arena, you just reminded me. You just reminded me. Let me see. Where am I ranked now? Rank 50. Yeah, let's go. Well, victory is deserved. Yeah. 
This person's using... Why her? Got it. Well, victory is desired. Oh my gosh. No. <laughs> okay, come on, bro. Chill out, man. Chill out, chill out, chill out, chill out. Thank you. These wild teams, dude. Got it. Great materials are everywhere. Oh, this is a healing team if I have ever seen them. Let's go take it to them. Oh, this tank is going. Nope. We're staying alive, homie. Nah. Nope, you're dead. You're gone. You're gone. We're better. We're better. We're tankier. Uh, well, like... Um... You can get her, like... I think you can get like two copies a month. So like you, if you get her from the arena, you can eventually like get her again. Like, I mean, you could always try to summon a copy, but I'm just saying like, you could use that for somebody else if you wanted to, is all I'm saying. If you want to, you could take them, you could take her on. All right, let's go with Reader. Okay, the Vela is a little scary. Okay. It's a little scary. Mm. She went invisible. Yo. Yo. No. I thought we were going to I thought we were going to do it, bro. Jesus, bro. No. Fuck. I gotta find all these stupid people. I post. Oh. I was on the internet, the comp, I posted it in the channel. Okay, Gordon. I'm gonna check it out. My tank is already dead. Oh my gosh. Oh, we're out of there. Oh, we're out of there. Oh, we're out. Oh my god. Silence my... Oh my gosh. No two losses in a row. Come on, I was so close. I need to play it safe. I need to play it safe.
Yo, Nero's over there living. Nah, bro did a whole character design lower and everything. Yeah, I know he was. <laughs> oh my gosh, yo! I'm gonna have to go. I'm gonna have to look at this. I'm gonna have to look at that, bro. Oh my god, this dude went all out. <laughs> I can never see the kick calling it a day. Nah, yo. I'm currently at the arena rank epic one with 229. It's a 128 power comp. Ugh. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Galaxy. I'm sorry. Oh, yo, Galaxy might be winning. He downed my Thoran. Hold up. Nah, homie. Nah, bro. Uh-uh. Sorry, Galaxy. Hold on. Oh, my God. He's about to kill me. There we go. We got the heals. No. Okay, there we go. There we go, baby. There we go. There we go. Sorry, Galaxy. <sighs> well. <sighs> I'm, uh, I mean, you know, and I'm, uh, no way this dude's running through my Thoran, though, dude. We're literally running the same team. Nope, gotcha. Fire period. Oh my gosh. Oh, we almost killed our Smokey! Oh my god, we just lost. We just lost. Oh, I thought we lost. <laughs> Not real smart, think. <laughs> Look, man. I'm just. Hey, bro. I'm just doing what I gotta do, dog. Bro, literally keep in my head a close battle. Great materials are everywhere. Okay, that that's a weird one. I don't know why you have your Vela way up here where she's just targeting a tank. Yeah, she just got locked down. Bro, why would you put your Vela over here? She just got burned down. That makes no sense. Man, thought he was cooking something, I guess. Well, victory is no mercy for me. If we would have lost those two fights, we would have hit the next rank. We're rank 30. Hang it, bro. We would have literally hit that next rank.
Pepper and overzealous yeeted me yesterday. <laughs> it's fine, I'll get those points back for reset. It's getting difficult, bro. It's getting difficult. Who's my next prey? Brutus! A great victory. The glory of which belongs to each and every warrior. Yeah, Dina, being over 400 uh, K power, hey, it's hard work out here in these streets. It really is. Especially for free to play, that's actually really good. I don't know if you're free to play or not, but that's that's really good. The glory of which belongs to each and every warrior. Brutus. Make some noise. This is our victory. Oh. Wow. Very low spender. Bought BP and small monthly class. Oh, then I mean, yeah, that's still a small. Yeah, that's still a small spender. It's really good. Yo, re -reminis uh, reminiscence. What's good? Welcome to the welcome to the stream. How you doing? Had a question for you for late game PvP. What are good map un uh, unit setups? Yeah. So like, if you're talking, ooh, I just realized my team. Great materials are everywhere. Mm, it's in my limit. But uh, so the main thing with the team, like the formation is usually okay. You just want to make sure like. Like, let's say, like, on this map right here, right? So, actually, I need to change all these. Like, if you're on the, like, just assume this is the attacking side. Like, you just want to make sure that you're, um, you have your tank covered, and, like, you can sometimes spread out your DPS, but it's not going to really do that big of a deal. But this is probably one of the easiest maps. Arena 2... Uh, some people like putting their DPS like right here. So same thing. If, just imagine it's the opposite side. A lot of people like putting their DPS here uh, because it just really helps out. And then I'm gonna put Coco kind of to the back because I don't want I want Coco to live just for the defense, right? So you do the same thing. Tank would be up here. Healer usually is a little behind. If you have a Haywin, you can kind of have your Haywin way back. But Smokey's different, right? So that's why Haywin's really good, because Haywin can be back here safe. Smokey kind of has to be up a little bit. Uh, DPS usually go over here, kind of angling out some damage. Uh, on this one, this is where you can kind of have, like, somebody do a sneak on you, which is a little scary, right? Um, you... You don't you obviously don't want that to happen, but like you can't make up for everything like you could put a warrior Or a thief to kind of go around on the back 
right? Like, that's what they really have. But I'm just hoping with my damage, I can hopefully, like, make up for it. But yeah, you typically put, like, a... You can put a tank here. You can put a warrior or an assassin to kind of come around. And then your healer. And your DPS. That's who you would want to go with. On this map, uh... I usually put my tank here because all of the DPS that's usually right here will target over here. Now, at sometimes like you know i can just uh leave it like this and just have everybody bunched up right and just wish for the best i'll leave it like that only because i have the tie the soulbind tie so like i want to put him there because i don't want to put smoky up here with him and i don't want to put anybody else so um it really depends on like who your tank is because your tank is usually going to target um this line here but if they end up uh but if you're on the attacking formation and you see like a team is like this you can literally put your tank right here and it'll cover everybody and if your tank is high invested it'll tank this whole team and then your dps can like attack for free so there is a downside to doing this um but for defense i like just knowing that my people will be somewhat safe without them just easily targeting my back line with like a tank running to them so yeah Arena 5, uh, I use, you know, you can do Tank in the middle. Uh, the only problem is, for me, I can't put, you know, Thorin um, with anybody, but it's whatever. But DPS are back. Um, and see, like, my healer's not protected, so I'll probably have to go all on one side like this or I could do Brutus for another front line over here to help out so I'll probably do that just somebody to help oh late game late game with Rainier Scarlet oh okay well hmm I haven't logged into this account for a long time. Mercy guides me as I fight with valor. Spent some, see, spent some, got hella lucky on your pulls with Stargaze. Got Rainier Supreme Plus already. Scarlet is nearly supreme. Okay. That's pretty, <laughs> that's pretty wild, honestly. Um. I don't have the frontline tank that I want.
Let me see, I should be ranked really low in PvP. I haven't played in so long. Yeah, okay. Alright, so... Yeah, I never got lucky. Sir Lucius, at your service. Here I am. So... <laughs> bro, this bitch is dumb. <laughs> um, so... Uh, the thing about Scarleta is that... Like, the position that she's at anyways... She's gonna... Pretty much turn the sides. Rainier is a little interesting. I'd have to show you my live streams. So Rainier's a little interesting because, like, you know, if you pretend this is Rainier, you kind of just position to get the unit that you want to delete, right? So if I'm looking at a team like this, CC is gonna be the biggest threat. So usually you try to line up like Rainier to be able to port uh your character over to them. Which, like, I was porting, like, when I had my Rainier in beta, I would port over, like, my Odie. Somebody can kind of survive and kind of just be thrown over there and, you know, just fuck shit up. Um, that's pretty much what you would do yes. on that end. Now, what seems to be the problem? Potions for sale! Buy four, get one free! Yep, and Scarlet is just here. She's literally chilling. And then we're waiting for her to crash down and then stun the whole team if we need it. This bitch is so broken. Is it worth using No, it's not. No, he's he's really bad on defense. It's uh he's really bad on defense. Scarlet, on the other hand, is way better. But no, he's really bad on defense. Because you can't, like, yeah. That's the same thing as, like, other, like, um... A lot of other characters, just really bad. I come to protect. New foes! New challenges! You're not even worth getting up for. Who else needs a little pick me up? Yeah, that's what I thought. Yes, as you command. Now, so yeah, so it's more worth to go this way. Your service. Who else needs a little pick me up? Potions for sale. Buy four, get one free. Yeah, I wish, I wish you could, like, s like, preset, like, Rainier to, like, you know, on defense, but you really can't, and it sucks. It really sucks. Oh my gosh, bro. I just know Sir Lee seems to be meta. Yeah, because so at the end game, most of the fights aren't really quick. So she smashes down, stun, like does ridiculous stuff. Uh, and destroys in PvP. Literally, like in any fight where that's why they say she gets a decisive victory. Because in any fight where it just looks like you're kind of going back and forth, Scarlita comes down and just wrecks shit up, bro. Yeah, she wrecks shit up because it's the stun, right? It's the stun. It's a, like just all of that combined. Like you really can't do anything about it. Like unless you like, you know, have some CC immunity. But yeah, CC goes crazy. Look, look at this fight where I look like I'm I'm behind and then just stunned like crazy. And she just goes in and she's a warrior. Straight up turns the tide of a fight. And when when you have copies in her, she just goes crazy. Yep, stunning. Yeah, you just delete us. Exactly, bro. And the true damage. So she'll eat through the tanks and everything. 
She's so good. She is so good. Yeah, I guess for some of you, you get to see... I know some of y'all saw some Rainier uh, on the beta. But yeah, you'll get to see a little bit of Scarleta. She's dumb, bro. Um, and it's the other light hypo worth it in PvP. Dianel. Dianel with the extra copies can be pretty good. But like I wouldn't say like well, I mean, you know, depending on how far you're you know you're going into it. So like let's I'll help explain it for other people too. Hold on. He's not like crazy, right? Because like it's a CC, it's a CC battle, so he just gets CC'd, right? Because you know that he has the penetrating attack that like hits everybody. He gets the extra attack speed. Like early on, right? Early on PPP, he gets really good, right? And he gets a crazy amount of attack speed, and he does a bunch of true damage, which is gonna be really sick. Uh, but when you look at some of the characters that, like, so you're gonna be fighting in PvP pretty much, like, Thorans, Scarletus. Uh, when it comes to healing, it, it really depends. Because, like, some people aren't even really going that crazy into healing, right? But for, like, defense, for defense, I feel like Dino could redo really good. But I feel like you want to pair him with somebody. The main thing I like is his Mythic Plus, but it's every 15 seconds. Where he summons the, uh, the Light Spear. This is probably the best skill. Right here. And the extra attack speed. I mean, he'd be a sick Ranger, though. But thing is, is like, I don't know if I like him over, I mean, I guess Sessia, because like, if Sessia doesn't get the ult, like, because Dino doesn't have to really ult, right? Like, his ult, Swords in the Air, can't be targeted for six seconds, during which he hits the area. I think that's what makes Dino really good. He doesn't have to ult. You have like five PvP, who should be your main team late trying to figure my key paragon units to get the rivalry stats. Hmm. So let's say we're in PvP, we have Thoran. You got Scarleta. These are two people, like one person has a revive, one person who can't be targeted. Um, the I'm looking at, I'm looking at, so what makes See, I 
I gotta use my I gotta try out my Damien and see how that blind works because I've heard the blind is like kind of crazy on Damien yeah Damien yeah yeah reminisce like the blind and the haste is actually pretty pretty nice because like your healer can die and like most of the team um like whenever you're like in stages like a lot of these healers can literally die especially with like scarletas and dianels being in the field like you know they're just piercing through everybody and can just straight up kill your team Like, Smokies who just sit there will die. Like, uh, Halen's are pretty tinky, but, like, everybody just gets nuked. Dad on these buffers, and we don't really have any that work with him. He's paired with Parissa. That's his best support right now. Yeah. I assume so. Like, he needs buffers. Yeah, that's right. His kit. His kit. Damn it, is Giga overpowered for some reason? Yeah. I don't know why they amped up. Him. That's right. Um, Dylano, where is it at? I read that somewhere. His uh, passive. Nectar feast. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah, Dino gains an attack of Constellation when receiving the non-permanent stat boost from an ally. Yep, there we goes. There it goes. Yeah, I was like, I read that somewhere. Yeah, that's the problem with him, Reminiscence, is he has, he has to get hella buffed. Dependent on people. And it's so crazy, too, that, like, I just win this. Like, look, she smashes down. And I'm about to smack. Like, just knock them all back. Like, she just wins this, guys. Don't worry. I'll get back at Lux. Oh, my God. I think plus enough for Scarlita. Is she a unit that really wants her Supreme skill? What's her stream skill again? Hold on. What's her skill again? I mean, that Supreme Plus is pretty sick for like making. Thoran just hard to die like whoever she puts that on that makes him hard to kill but I mean the mythic plus I think the mythic plus is what she needs though for the true damage I think that's like kind of similar to Rainier where he wants the mythic plus for the extra 25% damage I think that's pretty much what she wants for that true damage I mean, the Supreme Plus gets somebody really, really tanky. Scalita kills him by the res. She ignores his res? Oh my gosh, she does at Mythic Plus. She has an execute. Scarlet skill knocks the boss, non-boss enemies with HP lower than 180% attack and HP ratio below 20% out of the battlefield. The enemy set out of combat this way cannot return is considered defeated. Oh my god. She has an execute. <laughs> oh my god. 
I never, I haven't maxed. You got it at 10. I mean, cause like, if you knock out someone's Thor and then they're done for at late game, like, said Odis. I mean, people have Thoran. You literally have a Thoran killer instantly once she comes in. I mean, because, like... It's literally a tank killer. I mean, that's not just Thoran. That's, like, literally removing a unit from the game. So, let me see. So, you have Scarleta, who's not targetable. You have Damien, who's not targetable. Then you put Thoran. <sighs> Who are we looking at next after that? Like, let me look at the units that they like to use. Yeah, Odie's really good. Oh yeah, um, I just got her on my PTR account. I had enough. She's right here. In the unyielding light, judgment's arrival is imminent. Yeah. Aaron, Aaron, uh, Aaron groups him up, hits him with the CC, right? I think some people like, because uh, Aaron's, I mean, because Aaron with this, what is it? His Mythic Plus gets the extra, yeah. His Mythic Plus gives him the first cast of the ult. But he dies hella quick if he gets hit, though. Well, he does get the shield. Eventually, gets the dodge rate. Scarlita could protect him. I know there is a whole... Yeah, because of the CC, right? Because Arden... Duh, gets way more energy when all their CC, uh, and he just lowers his cooldown. He just hit like he CCs everybody, and then also Carolina, like wants them CC'd. It's a crazy CC team, crazy CC team. So. The thing about okay, so so Rainer's really good in the sense that let me see if I have let me see if I have some old footage. So, the problem with Rainier is that when you first get him, like, like, he has the teleport, but he doesn't give you the extra damage. 
So when you look at using him in like, you know, PvP, obviously everybody, like soon everyone's about to have him, right? Like very soon everyone's about to have him. But like he doesn't do much when you start out with him until you get a Mythic Plus to get the 25% extra. So this is in the beta. So I'm about to put him down, I think. And I can take a unit that I want. And I was sending my Thoran, I think, back there. Yeah, I was sending my Thoran back to the enemy squad to just be... I think I tried Kruger. Yeah, I tried Kruger for a while. I don't know why I didn't do Thoran back there. But yeah. Um, like, that's all you can really do when you first start out with him. And you can do that... Uh, yeah, AFK jumping, right? It's really nice. You throw this union over, then you just focus this character down. That's what you're going to be doing in PvE and PvP. For bosses, it's not really going to be, you know, um, as crazy. And he can, like, you know, lock down. See, I just basically got rid of that unit for now. And that's... Uh, that's pretty much what you do for PvE. But, and he can give you a little bit of uh, extra healing, but like in terms of like boss stuff, like you really want to get copies of him. Mythic Plus gives a 25%. You do get a little extra attack, but he needs copies um, to be. So, like, he's a character you got to kind of go the long way with and keep investing into. So many hours. Scar for AFK Progress, Rainer for Dream Realm, in my opinion. Yeah. Yeah, like, if you look at the Dream Realm characters, so, like, um, Gordon has a point. Like, the Dream Realm characters are, like, Corrin, Merrily, uh, Kruger, um, and those, right? Like, they're really heavy Dream Realm characters. Uh, like, they're good, but, like, that's what they're, they mainly are. Wow, she's keeping him alive. Oh, she just stunned. Oh my gosh! Scarlet is all them jump and row it. The the stuns in the CCs provides extra. Yeah, she's a really good progressing unit. What the hell is Valen cooking there? And Scarlita from the top row. She's going to get the whole team right here. She's going to get the whole team. Yo, Valen is going wild right now. Like you were saying.
Uh, well, the thing is that Scarlita, in terms of a free-to-play... Scarlita, like, this is a... Like, I'm using just a basic one. This is one that does everything she does now, right? I will say that Rainier, if you're wanting to do better boss damage, Rainier gets better with copies. Like, I can... I can honestly say that it gets better with copies. Um, to be able to like be like really good on bosses, like you know, you will hear people say like, "Oh, it's really good on bosses," but like it's like after copies. Pick me up. Yeah, she's just up in the air from the top ropes. She's giving out shield. So she does help out in protecting. And then, bam. Stunned. Just knocked them all up. Just came, came down. Now we got uh, Rowan providing energy. And she's about to hit the big stun. I could be getting one for a while though. What do you mean, Obi? Gene boss fight seems so random. <laughs> Chris can ruin a run. Yeah. The bot, like, the bosses be wild. But no, 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 no. Obi, we're, like, we have over, like, 20,000 guild coins. You're going to be getting one pretty soon. But if base card can help in AFK progress over we're going to need in copies, because I'm thinking... Rainier's good. Well, see, that's the thing. Rainier's good, too. For the swapping, but, like, Rainier also... Being on the like Rainier helps in the first part of the fight by teleporting somebody. Scarlita doesn't necessarily die in the first part of the fight. Now, here's the thing if you uh, like, if you're having trouble, Scarlita will come down from the sky, like, she doesn't stay up there the whole time. Like, if you're you know, take like taking a little bit of damage, she'll help out. But uh, I used Rainier for progress as well, being able to teleport a unit that is giving you trouble and kind of delete them and then being able to remove a unit from the uh the map is really useful i did not realize how close i was yeah we're all at 24k like we're getting the unit like soon i and don't get me wrong i like First off, Rainier and Scarlita are both better than Dianel. So, whichever one you pick is going to be a good pick. Um, we're getting tore up, by the way. Bro, this wrist just annihilated us from the back. Sure, what's up? What's up? What's good, Gordon? My Trippiner's dreams are getting super. I swear it was 1.5k on a rain copy. No, it was always 1.2. It was always 1.2. Literally, it's literally a <laughs> chicken with his head chopped off with the bazooka attached to his back. Bro, for real. Like, just running around crazy, just shooting random shots. My PTR account is so, like, ugh, so mid, bro. 
But I mainly just got the characters, like, just to talk about them. Oh, we're about to get another thousand. Legendary plus Viperion? Okay. I see you out here. But yeah, between the two, like, they're both really good, though. Like, because Rainier can uh, remove a enemy from the battlefield, which could literally turn the tide of a battle as well. And that's, like, the whole point of the unit, the two. Uh, Biriel and Dianel, I'm not really fans of. Even, like, Gordon and I were talking. It's, like, on paper, Biriel seemed like it would be good, but... Beerio's just, like, it looks cool, but it's just not the one. There we go. Bro, the healing on this team. Yeah, I need my CCA. I'm not gonna live. Stupid amount of healing. Cafra and Tundra Secure said Coco Cafra. Okay. What wild what wild shit are you cooking over there? Bro, I need an easier team to fight, please. You're not even worth getting up for. It's crazy how I have the star shard. Hold on, I have to re. Kafra. I ain't looked at Kafra and Bro, I'm losing all these fights now. You talking about that forest mark? You're talking about that forest mark. Holy shit. Okay, that's not bad. Damn. That healing. That healing was wild. Yeah, it's the four-legged wilder. That healing is wild. Yeah, but it, uh, Caffrey heals, uh, with a couple copies, Caffrey. Not even a couple copies. Just as an ability, Caffrey heals. He just needs high attack, is all. Needs melee team, though, where it's good with Maulers. Yeah, it is a melee team. Yeah, I'm looking at it. It is a melee team.
Which I know they'll be putting out some melee units. When you kill something, he heals around himself, so he's the one healer that can go along with melees. Yeah. Okay, okay. Are these fights are getting harder and harder. I'm just trying to get the... Is this Graveborn all the way? No. It's a mix. Bearer. My shield is unbreakable. Come on. A few more fights. A few more fights, my guys. Oh my gosh. Just a few more fights. Please. Please. Bro, come on. Don't do this to me, man. Yo! Bro, that. Oh, it is crazy. He has a forest mark. He seems cool, though. I used him in my, uh... Beta t uh, squad, but I didn't really... Pay attention to him much. Oh, I literally can't fight anybody. Hmm. Interesting. Oh, good day, boy. Without the salary increase. I am on Tondra. Keep training to keep growing.
I need to I need to play this one more. I literally went to worst fights. Bro, are you serious? Salazar? What is this guy doing? I'm just getting kicked, bro. Oh my god. Can't I can't fight any of these people. They showed me top ten wells were using him, but to be honest, I don't know what they see in him. Since when Salazar was used? Yeah, bro, Salazar. I'm like, what? Oh no, bro. Oh no. Oh! Did we just turn this battle over? Oh my gosh, Valen! Oh, come on, guys. Don't let this Lucius stall you out, bro. Stun this man. Yeah, his kit, yeah, his kit does not look impressive enough to me. Just need a couple more fights. Come on, please. Just give me a couple more. I need some easy fights. Two more easy fights. Bro, these people are just... Oh, there was a 120. I skipped it. Oh my god. How do I beat this team? I don't. I just don't beat this team. Okay. Well, Scarlita can take the target. Oh, it goes to. Oh, I just threw. I just threw. I didn't think it would move. I thought you could cheese it. But she's not on the battlefield. Oh, I threw. Is the Valen Lucius some sort of scar tech? No, 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 no. It's just the highest I have over here. No, no scar tech. But I can make some progress. At least. Yeah, this user. Come on, you'll need my spear.
Oh, it's just auto battle. We using. Oh, bro, I did like 20 battles of PvP. Yeah. Sorry, I'm just on my PTR account showing uh, Scar. You're sad? Yo, why are you sad? Yo, it's good, Jin, though. What happened? Just yeah, I just hadn't done it. Not on this account. I haven't played this account in a while. Oh, yeah, I swapped accounts. No, I don't have... No, I did not wail out. I can't see your strategy in PvP. What do you mean my strategy, bro? What do you mean my strategy? These are people rocking the brilliant spark title, but I don't see it on the title screen. What? It's because you were late? Hold on, let me, let me go back over real quick. I don't have any pulls. Let me see. Well, this is... Twenty three million power. Twenty six million. Thirty three. Oh, whew. Oh my god, this is PTR whales, bro. I don't know what y'all be eating. Fucking CEOs. I gotta get to this one. I was wondering why uh, I said, wait, man, you helping people proxy like a hundred times. <laughs> it's worth the watch your strike, you know? That's just, <laughs> they don't eat. Bro, it's wild. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let me go back over. It's crazy that my global account's now stronger than this one. Because I just stopped playing as much, and that's what happens. This probably killed on this one has a whole ass. Oil prints in their ranks, bro. Dude, there's some people. <laughs> like, I get like having disposable income. Like, you know, you have a check, you spend a couple hundred dollars. Like, you know, you chilling. But some of them have dropped like s continuous amounts of money, like just consistently. For, <sighs> like, call me on S1 is already eight mil with. 16 Paragon 2s. Oh my god, man. Oh, here it goes. But I'll be telling y'all be getting messages.
I be getting messages, bro. This like 460 throw. Oh my god. Only better get in line. But yeah, I'm PvP. I already did all mine. I just run. This is the team I run. I don't run nothing special. When I do PvP. I mostly just use Coco. I mean, I'm still, like, decently ranked. Ooh, I'm 65 now. You've been beating me on the formation. Does anybody have any proxies? No one has any proxies. But yeah. But yeah, I'm I'm definitely thinking about uh Scar eventually. Well he is in Scarlet, and Scarlet is a massive wheel good in every game. Hmm. I never see him used, but then again I'm a free to play bum. No, I don't like Brutus. I just have him as a secondary tank over in PvP. Wow. Brutus is not what he used to be in AFK Arena. He just died, like, he, his invincibility he gets, I feel like he just dies immediately in Prox's invincibility. Like, I do not like him. And he needs hella life chain and hella, like, levels and stuff to where he can actually heal up. Like, but by that time, you're still just getting deleted. Like, by the time you get him to where he can, like, sort of heal up and stay alive and be invincible, he's just not what he was before. Like, wow. Victory. he was so, uh, to me, he was so much better in, um, his past game. How's Brian's performance? Well, I literally got a copy of him from the, uh, I got a copy from, from the login. He seems, he seems all right. And I'm really trying to give him a, oh, can I increase somebody? You desire an audience. And what? You're the only one who's never betrayed me. We will make them pay. You're the only one. May make me more like I don't think he's like necessarily the You're the only one who's never the ooh, the greatest like pay. character but like he does have a little bit of burst at least from these PvE stages from what I've been seeing oh oh yo Captain Barisa It's like my Odie's not leveled pretty high. The only thing I like about him, though, where is he at? Well, just in time. Hmm. Hmm. I see. Understood. Thank you. Yeah, it has a little bit of like for PvP. Yeah, the mythic. Like, he has, like, a little bit of a revive. Basically, that's kind of, like, the only thing I like. Like, towards the end. Other than that, he just seems like a normal... EX weapon and skill wise, who are your primary targets upgrade early? So for me, I uh, Cecia is still like my uh like just my main carry for right now for who I've been investing into. Um But I believe like over the course of a longer like uh <laughs> he looks cool, you go cool party stuff, I guess. Yeah, like he's just I just have a lot of characters to miss. If I were to think over a long period of time, like I know that CCO's 
probably gonna be a little weird, but like her EX skill, I uh, I like the I like the entangle, but it's not crazy. But you're the only one who's never. Let me see. Was it Thorin's? We will make them pay. Thorin's is nice because it gives him an extra heal, but he's still gonna get deleted. Odie's works if he kills a target, but I know it's not boss. I'm trying to think who else I like. Oops. It, it was an accident. I know for late game, Haywin ends up being pretty crazy because of the reduced reducing the damage. Um because I I think that's where she yeah, ends up surpassing like the the damage on the Mythic Plus for Smokey, I know is nice, but I think Kaywin being able to protect you is what pushes her further on her ex uh, exclusive weapon. Um, Looking for me? No, not her. Who else am I looking for? Yeah, it's really hard. I have to get back to you on that. Because, like... You're the only one. I've invested into my, like, I'm investing into my Thoran personally because I really want to where we can heal him. Like, when he has the pact, I want to be able to give extra healing to him. Alright, Gordon. Turgo, I've been seeing ads for AFK Jenny. Where has it? Oof, an ad. Uh, AFK Journey, it's kind of like a little bit of a open world AFK arena game. Is it fun? Uh, it's been pretty fun for uh, my community from R99. We've been playing it. So it's just like uh, the regular AFK arena in terms of battling, but you have this open world where you collect stuff, you do your battles, you have AK progress, PvP. We have like guild fights to do together, some co-op events. Um, really fun community game. Uh, we've been really enjoying it. I, uh, I, I love it personally. So I guess we jump over here and he moves. Yeah, that's what it is. Oh man, I wasn't paying attention. I looked away. Are you serious? Come on, man. <sighs> I shouldn't have sped it up. I'm messing up on this. All right, keep it slowed down. Lucky, come on. Hop over here.
And then... There we go. There we go. My shots are perfect today. I'll get that later. I try to push story as much as I can. Them in this merrily. this chest yeah there's probably some stuff over there too switch story we'll come back yo we're at 757 we'll probably hit 800 today we will probably hit 800 yo galaxy See everybody just chilling here. Corrupt creature. I really want a graveborn healer, bro. But not, uh, Jin, when I put down Brian, like, he was doing some decent, like, damage. Like, I was like, hey, yo, bro. Like, he might not, like, he might be, like, a mid-game or something like that for me, but, like, for the fact that he's doing some decent damage while, you know, she's supreme, I was like, okay. I see you. So I'm still... Oh, dang it. Yeah, I put him on that spot. He died. I put him in the wrong spot. Ooh. Lord. Well, victory is Seems like a good sub DPS. Yeah, he does. I like him so far. I'm liking him so far.
my god. What y'all talking about? Oh, crow creature. We get that. Nice. Well, it doesn't matter when it's like a whole region itself. Ooh, hey, yeah, get over there. I got really lucky, but I only have my Supreme Plus is man turtle keeps Supreme Plus every unit, bro. He really, <laughs> he's really just like so. I told Turtle, hey, bro, this isn't this kind of game. You gotta focus on characters, right? Because like it's gonna be really hard out there. So you know what he said? Bet I'll just get every character max duped, so then I won't ever have to worry. I was like, that wasn't the correct answer to that. But I guess it was, for him, there was more than one way to answer. So I said, I'll just, I'll just max everybody out. Come on, come on! Oh, no way, bro. Wow! Yo, Jen, thank you for the follow. Paragon. Yeah, Jen, he's going for Paragon, bro. Man, <laughs> he's going a little wild. He's going a little wild. For the god of war. Let's see, can Brutus do it? I don't think Brutus got it. Oh no, he does got it. Yeah. The dude is. Like, I don't think anyone in our server has Paragon. Maybe a few people. No, I think there's, there might be a couple Paragons, but it's just like, wow. I was literally just like, wow, okay. Like, you really going out there, bro. But hey, he's in our guild. He's chilling. He's happy. Whatever makes our whale happy, it's fine. Whatever makes the whale happy will not anger the whale. Another card from Shadows probably does. Oh, yeah, that's right. It probably does. S91 has one. Bro consistently tells me good words. Alright guys, already 5 a.m. See you good night. Alright, Dina. Jeez. 5 a.m. for you. Yo, purple. What we get? Hyperion. Jesus, bro. Hyperion be getting copies, man. He be getting serious copies. New food is 
is coming. Ah, come here. Not gonna lie, it's 3 a.m. for me. Yeah, I guess this. It's only 9. It's only 9 p.m. In my neck of the woods, at least. Yo, I think I might hit 800k. Yo, all the guildies here, bro. I'm like two away. Hmm. Might do a little summon right here so I can get that. Just a little summon. Ah, didn't give me enough. It's fine. I'm on Turtles marketing team. Oh, wow, well, Jin. <laughs> oh, okay, here we go. Yo, we're still good. Gonna spam his emote around. He has pretty good emotes. My emotes aren't, uh, they're not as good. Let's see, we're gonna use a little Roman. I got, um, this, let's see. Hold on. Bow before the king. Yeah, these are mine. Yo, my answer cleared. New area. Yeah, that's what I that's what I use for whales. That's what I was spamming uh, to. Um, I had it from TOF, but that's what I was spamming on a turtle at times. <laughs> the animated whale. <laughs> it's a whale alert. <laughs>
Yo, we brought him back. Well, victory is deserved. Oh, there goes overzealous, just chilling. Just made the best choice. What? Oh. You just made the best choice. Oh, I see, I see, I see. I see. You just made the best choice. Wait, what? You just made the best choice. Okay, there we go. There we go, there we go, there we go. Yo, Jinkai thank you for the sub, subscribe bro. to your channel for one month. Three months? Yo, man, I appreciate that. I appreciate that, man. Needed that one. Needed that one. It all goes towards my monitor. My, my daughter's broke my girl's broke my monitor, so I gotta replace it. Yo, I forgot that was your sub noise that I opened the wrong tab. <laughs> The monitor, yeah. Kaki Gotcha says I smashed it. I got, I got angry at a, <laughs> I got angry at an AFK stage. The menace is now 3-0 on my equipment. Yes, actually, she is 3-0 on my equipment. Like, I, bro. At this point, it's like, bro, is it even worth being a streamer, man? Like, I ain't making no money. She keep breaking this stuff. Gonna get that whale. <laughs> I love the whale emote. Cocky was like, bro, it's just an AFK stage, man. It's gonna be all right. Okay, Nero is about this limit. <laughs> Take it easy. Nah, man. Them, them stages be stressful, bro. You know? You be stuck on it. You be stressing out. Next thing you know, hole in the monitor. Be stressful. Nah, I didn't even ever get that serious. That's what they AFK stages, bro. I'd be like, you know what? I'm gonna tackle this another day. We gonna tackle this the next day. Oh, CC girl, we gonna get on somewhere.
<laughs> Bro. The one responsible for the corruption is right here in We were beating you. Young mage, don't try to use your limited knowledge to underestimate an immortal graveborn. That's rude. Hold on, I'll be right back. Right. The graveborn's link is between life and death, belonging neither to the dawn nor to the night. How can they possess the power of life? Corruption, life, resurrection, the trees surrounding the village, where corrupted roots entwine, wilt, and wither. Meanwhile, the Graveborns, who shouldn't have the ability to resurrect, keep coming back. I get it. You are stealing the life force of the Dark Forest. You mean they draw life from the surroundings through the corrupted roots and channel it back into themselves? Precisely. This is why Eomir sought to join forces with the Adamant Syndicate and corrupt the Lucent Tree. He's planning to seize the gift bestowed upon the forest by Mesate. A long and enduring life. How come you don't seem surprised at all by this conclusion? Well, it seems that occasionally there are some bright minds among the living. <laughs> well... Let me continue savoring your struggle. Come now, you think I'd use my full strength against weaklings like you? Hold on, I hear something. I hear the sound carried by the wind. Eomir's leading the Thorn Guards to the Lucent Tree. He intends to implore Masate for divine blessings, asking for the eradication of all corruption. We've been tricked. She's here to hold us back so Eomir can corrupt the Lucent Tree. I do appreciate smart individuals. Oh, by the way, for those of you who missed the R99 stream... Nice, I got my star shard. For those of you who missed the R99 stream today, we uh, activated the, the portraits of uh, Joe. It's pretty, uh, it's pretty wild. I had her, uh, I was doing a raid. Damn, you missed some delayed wailing. Yeah, I was on the stream earlier. On the, the Projected of Dreams boss, we did like, now, okay, so here's the funny thing. At, the further we went up in portrait, like, so we were doing the boss, and I wasn't testing her by herself. I was using her on a whale setup. So I was using... So the first one, I was just doing Getian. I was doing Getian, Ezra, Isolde, and Joe. And at P1, she kind of outdamaged Isolde. But then literally after that, Isolde came out on top. Every Like, the more portraits we got, the... Like, it was crazy. Like, the more damage the Soul Day was doing over Joe. <laughs> like, and then uh, we did a run with Joe, a Soul Day 37, and uh, Ezra. And we were able to do like 1.6 mil uh, score. I don't know why I don't have the Star Shark spell yet. It, uh, I didn't get it from the shop, right? Um, I got it from just this story right now after beating Cecia. Oh, wow, we're 8.35. Dark Forest. Uh, so we came back to five, but we walked around in seven and it had us come back to five, like right here. Like we just got it after fighting Cecia. So if you fought Cecia as the boss, that's when you should get it.
But I only have two artifacts, I think. Yeah, the artifacts are pretty... Pretty good. I think we can push up a little in here. Why does she sound like Ash Ketchum saying, let's go? I can see that. She does kind of sound like Ash, though. That raspy, that raspy teenager voice. Yo, come on! I remember, I remember Turtle being on stage four hundred like three days ago. Oh my gosh, Rowan just got deleted. Who is that? That's there, Brian. Oh my gosh. Bro. Yeah, he's up there on 700, yeah. Oh my gosh! Bro needs two teams now? Is that why he's doing more whaling? Yeah, no, he has all these char he has a lot of characters. Come on, we got this. Oh yeah, 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 we got this one. We got this one. We can probably switch out Aaron for uh, Viperion now. But we're getting so much energy, he's just flying, like his bird is just flying around. Bow, but for the king. See, he's doing 153. So yeah, let's try switching him out for Viperion. Oh, that's a big bump. That's a big bump right there. Bow, 
before the king. Oh, wow. We got it. Bow before the king. Oh. Primal learning again. It's a. Uh, it's so it's a uh, rank by server. However, quick you can kill him, but it's like gems, uh, some extra gold and stuff like that. Like nothing like you know, some extra pulls. Nothing super super groundbreaking. Yeah. But it's something the whole server fights, so. I don't think it's servers competing with each other. I just think it's, uh, we just, as a server, beat it. We, as a server, beat it. No. If it was servers competing with each other, we would lose. Because there's people with 23 million account, like a 23 a million account level. Some people with 8 and 6 million like already from global like no <laughs> no running rowan smoky and cc all together so much fun yeah right now um i'm just running coco to help out with a little bit of survivability but yeah it's uh it's been really nice Well, All right. victory is yeah, that makes up core. My most scenes are very solid. Nice. This stuff's on OD2, despite not being an epic. He's crazy good. Oh, yeah. He's. He is a DPS monster. OD. My appearance sacrifice is HP for damage, right? Yes. And he's uh really good with like the dot damage and stuff. He's not like um He's just really good um by just draining HP and recovering it back. Wow. 
Well, victory is deserved. But he does like a lot of AoE HP drain, basically. Like, a lot of HP drain. That's why I like him. Bow. Plus, I keep getting copies of him, too. Come on. But I like Coco with him too because Coco reduces damage. And so that way if he does get hit, uh, he's not, you know, going to get completely nuked. But I'm really liking him. So let's see. We just got a uh, copy of him, so he's like mythic. Uh, not mythic, he's legendary plus. Right now. Ooh, Rowan's out. Rowan's out. Here we go. But look at that healing. He was trying. He was trying his best. Probably a throw in Smokey. Smoke as you do it. Yeah, it does have the beast. I probably need to play it and get up to Dark Forest to show y'all. Well, victory is because it's up right now. That way I can get my guide out and stuff. So I'll, I'll work on that account. Yeah. Because I know you... Uh, <laughs> I know you're wanting to know, Jink. I know you're gonna, I know you're looking for the guide. I know you're gonna be looking for the guide and be like, hey yo, bro, where's that inside information, dude? Where's that? <laughs> I need it. <laughs> Cause it's crazy. I told you I told you about Coco and you're like I think your Coco was like Epic Plus when Skyclops is out. And you put Coco on and you're like, hey, yo. <laughs> you're like, Coco kind of, kind of good. Because Coco's new, even to PTR. Coco's really new. It's like the newest hero. Just drop Vila's trailer. I'll have to react to that um, after. Yeah, I need it, bro. Coco been putting in work at Elite Plus. <laughs> Coco's great. Coco's really great. Like, honestly. Probably second fave for performance alone. Yeah, from that, a speed run Coco Supreme. Yeah, Jink, you know what I'm saying, bro? Like, dude was like, nah, I'm gonna need that. Dude went all the way in. After that, he's like, oh. She's literally the only way you can survive high levels of Skyclops, too. 
and a lot, lot of content. Just that extra mitigation is crazy, especially when she gets haste. Like, it's so good. Yo, we are going right now. We are really on a roll right now. What is going on? We were like three. We were like three something. But I got like hella copies of my Thoran uh, earlier, so. We got like three copies of them. So I was able to get him up to Supreme Plus. And he's, I mean, as long as he's alive, everybody else can do what they need to do. Yeah, Coco's a pretty cute character. I like Coco. Oh, Rowan just got deleted. Oh, oh, oh. Is this Wilder comp? Is that why? Yeah. This is Wilder. Hmm. Oh my gosh, bro. Don't let this be mine. Hey, yo, man. What the fuck? For the god of war. Let's go take it to him. Oh, this is annoying. No, I didn't want to do that. Come on. Oh my gosh, bro, these source. Yo, Sun Urio, thank you for the follow. The AK-15, she gets wild. Oh my god. Yeah, bro. Uh, okay. Okay. Daddy Thoran, bro. That was crazy. That was crazy. That was absolutely crazy. Oh my god, that was crazy. But yo, what's good? What's good? Uh, sounds good. Twitch. We're double streaming right now. Twitch and YouTube. I have a YouTube channel as well. I have a couple of boss guides and stuff. We'll be putting out more. I should. I think I could farm. You know, Jin. I think I could farm out that. Well, no, my account is kind of. My account's kind of whack. Um. On that one.
Hmm. At least for the guide, I need to get it out. Cause when does he come out? Two days? Ah, okay. Yeah, let me. I think we're 838. We're making good progress. We've been going up. All right. Let's go right here. Not the much watching people play this game while also playing. I'm just saying my my account's kind of whack over on my PTR. I mean, I got Scarlita recently, but. Oh, wow. Okay. Another Coco. Hey, bro, we stay getting Cocos on over here. Yo, no way. And Odie. Are we getting meta? All meta characters? We just got three meta. Well, and we got a Viperian, which we have. We literally got copies of what we use, dude. I'm telling y'all, my luck, I just get the characters I need, specifically. Like, I I really do be getting characters I need. Like, it's, it's really good. New food is coming. Come here. She's three away from Mythic. Hmm. This this man turtle. Hold on. Let's go to pizza. Oh, another Scarlet fanboy. Uh, I like Rainier, but I know that Rainier needs copies. CO privileges turned on. All this Rainier talk and Scar talk. I just singled Scar. Really? Wow, bro. You just singled Scar? That's crazy. This point, Lux would be... Would get wing sign before she's even rollable. What are you talking about, bro? It's always a great word pulling of the insane clutches. Alright, so... Wait, what account did I? <gasps> I haven't played the new story. Well, wow, I have 20 million books. There's no way it's going to make me play through the whole story all over again. <laughs> oh my gosh, I got to play through everything over again. All right, guys. Well, let's get to grinding. My shield is unbreakable. I mean, I get to delete everything, at least. That's the least thing. That's gonna be wild using Scarleta on the beginning. Like, 
<laughs> Somebody's gonna see me playing the beginning missions and be like, why do you have Scarlita? Did you wail as soon as you joined the game? Like, nah, bro. Yo, regular guy, thank you for the follow, bro. Welcome to the stream. Welcome to the stream. All right, I think my... Go. No way he says consider it content. I guess it is content. Scarlet is just doing her thing. It's light bearer team.
Bro, four Hippo Gian with Supreme Plus Citrana is unstoppable. I'm destroying higher level. I'm guessing he's saying using all of the... Using Burial... Using Burial... So he says four Hippo, but it's the two Celestial... Two uh, Hippo units with Citrana, and he's deleting everything. Like, I mean... One second, level 55. Free to play? Oh, did you just start? Did you just start? Or is today's your first day? Because that's about the level everyone stopped on their first day. Supreme Plus? Supreme? Oh my gosh, bro. Second day? Yeah. The Omega Whale team. Bro, Jin doesn't even have that, bro. Jin, you slacking, dog. Jin and Turtle slacking. Like, bro, where is the Burial? Where is the Burial? Dianel, Scarlita. Like, bro, where's the team? Our whales are slacking, man. Like, saying that you're destroying content at that point doesn't really mean... Like, I mean, does that really mean, like, something crazy? My shield is unbreakable. If you aren't rocking the Hypo Celestial Squad, are you even playing the game? Yeah, for real, bro. Like, Jin Dog, you slacking, man. Slacking. Heart of the credit card is real. <laughs> I remember a guy on PTR run that team. Yeah. I mean, it is definitely possible for the PTR server to have at least two from the guild stuff, but yeah. My shield is unbreakable. My shield. Yeah, this is just going. This is literally just going. Yo, if you join the Discord, regular guy, uh, we actually have a um, help section. We can get you some uh, help. Look at your account. It doesn't cost anything. Uh, you know, just join the Discord up. Full Celestial Hippo plus Igor. Oh, that sounds annoying, Jin. Yeah, exclamation discord. I have a R99, which is our main game. Um, like, we just have more people for that. And then we have AFK. We're building the community on that as well. Bro, look at that scar. <laughs> this is people in our guild anymore. If you doing random people I see on the map. You have an addiction to proxy battles. You're like, yo, I want to be the savior of the server. I try to help other people too. If I'm not like doing mad progression, I try to help out. Yeah. This was the inevitable result. I'll be right back. Give me a sec while this kind of goes. This will be a Chair Coon stream. Enjoy Chair Coon.
just as I expected. Just as I expected. Chirkun, I feel like he's about to catch up to me. Chirkun can destroy Scar. Is it no Scar to OP? No, that's what he's saying. My PTR account, I haven't logged into it for a while. That's what he's saying. Yo, what's good, casual Dre? Hey, what's good, Obi? See, free to play day two, stuck in the dark forest. Dark forest one. Ooh, yeah. Um, let me see. Oh well, I would go. I would really try to get a team buff. So let's look. Oh. I would say maybe try getting the Tiba by rocking uh, Miriam, Miriam, uh, and try. If you need the two tanks, I understand that. Mm, maybe try taking off and t maybe try taking on Tandra and putting on another light bear. Because going the three, uh, getting at least three of the same faction, it gives you a ten percent attack and health buff. Like, yeah, to just like continue to, like, taking a dip in quality. This game looks amazing, but it like concerns me. Um, actually, Dislight is doing um, numbers. It's just when they first came out, they had really terrible monetization. Basically, like it was like two hundred pulls for a fifty-fifty. <sighs> Pity. There was no guarantee. It was like 400 summons for a guarantee. Um, but like, I think I looked at it recently. If you're curious. Because Lilith has never had a game EOS. So... Let me see. No, I was looking on Sensor Tower. This isn't where I'm looking. Come on. 
I saw it. Um, was it was it on Sensu Tower? There we go. This was the site. I said, okay, so global. So they do about 900 to 1 mil. It's not bad. It's not like amazing, right? Now JP is kind of fallen off. It's at like 50 to 60K. Um, and then yeah, CN is what I saw. CN is doing millions. Um, so eight five two. Now it is going down. Not exactly sure why. Maybe because of AFK Journey. Could have been a big part of it being the next game. But uh, like we can't. We aren't gonna get any AFK Journey numbers yet. Oh, actually, as of March twenty seventh, we're already at. 2.2 million PC revenue not included. Oh, so this is just mobile revenue. Wow, okay, so PC revenue is gonna be huge. Cause I like a lot of people buy on PC. PC revenue is gonna be huge. My shield is unbreakable. Yeah, just like we'll have yeah, we'll have it. But Dislight was a pretty cool game. It's just they messed up their banners. I really liked it. I would have stuck with it for a lot longer. But, like, those banners kind of just screwed my thoughts about it. Yeah, I was worried about the direction Dislight was going. Looks like it's continuing, but I'll have to give this a shot. Thanks for the response. I'm good. Good shot that Lilith hasn't ever yes. Yeah, I I haven't seen any of their games because AFK Arena is still doing good. They have um, Age, of Con Age of Empires or whatever. Like, they haven't EOS anything. They put a lot of ad revenue together. They're a CN-based company, so I think the CN games is what really, you know, helps them out. But, like, AFK Arena's been going strong. Like, it's going strong. And there's... The amount of money that's been, that people have put into AFK Arena is wild. Like, people put so much money into that game. <laughs> like... I think it was Roman can sustain a single healer to be fair. As long as you focus on your DPS to get some quick kills or leave some pressure off the tank. Oh, you're talking about earlier. Alright, let's go. Thanks for the info. So got Roman from Mage and it's working. Oh, it is? Okay, cool. Okay, you got that extra buff. The, the faction buffs are good most of the time. Sometimes you can forgo them, but faction buffs are really good. It's extra it's free extra stats. It's really solid. That's why you might hear a lot of times people say to focus on a team. Bro, yo, Obi, Scarlita. I, I know I know we did Rainier in the beta. We looked at Rainier, but like, bro, Scarlita looks fun. Scarlita seems fun, bro. <laughs> Okay, I can see it. I'm not even at the end yet. <laughs> I'm running through my AFK progress with her right now and wrecking PvP. Yeah, bro. I used uh, Rainier in the beta 
And it was it was always between Scarleta and Rainier, right? Like Rainier with copies, you do more on bosses, but Scarleta just yeah, PvP in certain stages, she's just Rex. Like, I mean, Rainier don't get me wrong with the teleporting somebody over is nice, but this CC is kind of crazy that she does. Thought Rainier was gonna be a no-brainer, but Scar might actually be the play. Yeah. Random question: Is AFK Journey Spender pretty win rather than free to play? Uh, it benefits. It benefits like Spender pay to win. Um, it's not really pay to win. It's more pay to advance, I guess you would say. All right, Tin Lee, you have a good one, bro. But like free to plays can definitely like the thing is like free to plays can definitely get progress. You just have to be patient. Like you can get a lot of uh, you can get characters fairly well. You get a decent amount of pulls. It's just that f you'll get stuck as a free to play and have to like wait for like a reset or something like that. Yo, Kator one two three. Thank you for the follow, bro. Appreciate you welcome to the stream. Dang, we're still going. Did you know there's a mechanic in the game to limit the number of attempts you can have at a stage? I know about on like some of the like tower stages and stuff, it just auto completes it. But no, I didn't know there was a limit. <laughs> I never hit that limit. It prevents you from attempting it for a set period of time unless you pay coins. What? It's like a 253. Should I buy from the shop? I don't care about free to play. It's like a 253. Uh. If you're wanting the the best, like I mean, well, so if you are gonna spend. And you're wanting like the best bang for your buck. Oh my god. Yeah. So I don't know what you have bought, but the monthly is really good. You get 3k and you get gems every day. And the premiums that you set gives you 10 summon here. And they'll give you two of these per day. Uh, the growth bundle is really good if you are putting in a lot of progress into your game. Uh, like, so you said you're at two fifty-three, so like you would get quite a bit of pulls here. And this is before you get in anything crazy. These are some things that you can do. If you're on a Discord call and have someone proxy it, you can kind of bypass that. And it takes steps. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Bro, I keep hitting the wrong button. Going for wish lists.
No, it isn't terrible. It's only for 30 minutes to coin payments or manageable. Oh, okay. You can buy the duck pack 10 times and get 3k per, so 499. You can buy the duck pack 10 times and get 3k per, so 499 for 3k. Oh, yeah. So you spend like, yeah, you can do that. You can buy it up quite a bit, I, I heard. Those who know I might do that. Will have. What are you hunting? My main. Yo. How many did I need? I can get somebody from here. Hmm. Oh, wait. Brothers, armor for my for the life bearers. Okay. Yo. All right, Coco. Cool, cool. Bro, I should have kept playing this account, man. I would have had a crazy one. I should have really kept playing this account. That's wild. It just caught me completely off guard that they'd had a feature like that. Yo, baby. Like it. We like that, bro. We like stay. Another Coco. Okay. Awesome. Any questions, young Arden. Yo. Hmm. I mean, I do have Light Bear, but that's not who I wanted. That's not at all who I wanted. But I guess I can make content. <laughs> I guess. I can make a little guide on her, I guess. I want more. Hmm? What's up? Looking for me? That is definitely not who I was looking for, though. Hmm. I'm not gonna do well in this. Let's go take it to him. Who else needs a little pick me up? Sir Lucius, at your service. You're not even worth getting up for. <sighs> Time for work again. Oh, well. At least we clear the first one. Pretty sure Arden is like his granddad. I think I heard from Sword at some point. I believe it. I believe it.
I'm rank 120. Am I really rank 120? Okay. Is this where we hit our limit? Wait, what's going on here? It's a lot of damage. <laughs> I did all of that just to get to 116. I mean, I know I was gonna get high. Look at my face. Oh, it just saves me the price straight up. Look at these drums. Oh, I almost hit the wrong one. Oh, I need... The general has asked me to protect you. Not that you need it. May the glorious rippling flame... Food is coming. Oh. 
good day, Barb. Okay. So we can let that kind of set for a while. We casual just have a TCA. TCA. Mythic Plus, he gets the 25% extra damage increase to the person that he uses to teleport on. Even though the boss can't teleport, it's a 25% increase. Also, he has life drain to units to help with healing. And he does like some decent damage, but it's mainly for the damage increase. And he's like, you know, flexible as well. And he does HP percent damage as well. He does HP percent damage as well, which is really good. So he's a boss killer. But he's still functional. Like he still does his HP percent damage and everything like that. He still does a lot. So his, so his kit without like, yeah, so if the enemy is above 61%, then each hit attached extra damage equal to 1% of their current HP, up to 20% of attack. So he does HP percent damage, he does a lot. You get all of that at the first copy. Yo, I'm Big Cup, thank you for the follow. Enjoy the video, am I free to play? On this account, I uh, this is a PTR account, so uh, I spent one dollar on it to get a copy of Rowan. But um, this is a PTR account, and I haven't played it for a while, so I should be much further. But yeah. Both him and Scar- like, both Rainier and Scarleta are really good units. But yeah, Rainier is going to be definitely good for the bosses and stuff. But what's good, Jordal? On my main account, on my main account in server 25, I am not a free-to-play, though. We're talking about Rainier. He does HP percent damage on his uh, second skill, Golden Ratio. Think about it for me, I might scoop up Rainier in the guild shop to have both at the disposal. Yeah, if you already have, you know, Scarleta, or if you already have Rainier, then you could pick up the other, right? It's definitely possible. How much have I spent? On my main account, uh, a little under 200. On this account, I've only spent a dollar. But this is a PTR account, so. Like, you can spin in PTR, I, I just haven't. It's because you just don't think about it. Yeah, the shields she gives is a lot. She actually gives really good shields. Like, she's just up here giving crazy amounts of shield for survivability. Bro, look at that. And then she's about to smack down. Yeah. It's so nice, bro. How far am I in my main? 
Uh, I think I just got to 400k. 450? Maybe something like that? I have to look. My team power is like 800 something. Eight thirty-three, maybe. And around two hundred spent. Yeah, I got really lucky though. Switch, I got really lucky. Cause what I bought, I bought the hundred-dollar pack. That gives you the selector, and then I got the five-dollar. So I bought the hundred-dollar pack. That gives you the selector, the hero selector, right? And I got. Uh, I got a lot of copies of Cecia back to back, so I bought her like you know the fifty dollar pack you get to get a copy. So that's how I got her up to Supreme. So that's one fifty, and then I spent thirty on the thirty on the pass, twenty on the uh, monthly. And the the monthly stuff, so the fifteen and the five dollars. So yeah, two hundred. Got yeah, kind of lucky too. So around fifty, my CC has max dupes. Yeah, so my Thorin is max dupe, and my CC is um, supreme. So she's two away from max. Think about hey, bro, two hundred. Two hundred is like. Not bad. It's definitely not R99, though. R99 be... be taking the wallet. Plus, I'm not ashamed. I'm not the craziest in the guild, so... My spending is... is low compared to the... the others. The one dollar packs in this game. Oh yeah. They might not be good value, but they're so attractive, bro. They be trying to get you with the extras. Oh, turtle hopped off. Giga Weld, I'm on S190. You Giga Weld? S190? Jesus. That's. You gotta be one of the top players, because, like, I feel like ain't nobody. I I feel ain't nobody in S190. <laughs> We're on S25. <laughs> and we have, like, Giga Wells at ours. But S, S120? S190? Jesus, guys. <laughs> That's so far away. You started the other day? Yeah. In S8, in S89, we got some crazy wheels too. Dang. Well, I guess you gotta get lucky and get one of those. 
in one of those free to play servers. That's what everyone should have done. You should have got. A, we should have had a free to play community get together, right? And just be like, all right, guys, we're gonna fill this up with free to play. They could, they could let people select, but that wouldn't be like, no one would like that. Be like a server for the game where no one can spin, and it's just based off of luck. Nobody would like. I mean, a lot of people would like it, but like, it's just gonna be servers open just for no reason. We have a week before the promo load is up. Oh, okay. Are they merged in service though? I know a lot of people would like it. But like, yeah, low popularity service, they're probably merging them. Just a non-spending server. It'd probably be actually overcrowded. The like if they had a, a non-spending like a free-to-play server. That would be crazy, now that I think about it. Eventually, people would get frustrated. Most of the server would be all mine before they merge. Free resources. I would love to see one where everyone has the same account. See? Yeah. Give everybody a Paragon account and see how far they can go. Just be like... Since you gotta have two teams, so, like, give everybody their pick of characters. Bro, we are. Dang. I need to play through the story. That means I gotta grind so much of this game. Tomorrow, because I gotta play through the story. But gotcha games are my downfall, so that's why I spend so much. I spent 1500. But wouldn't be spending for a bit. I'm going on vacation next week. Oh, I mean. People love getting strong, getting characters. Bro, don't worry, 1500, like, like, yes, yeah, spending 1500 a couple of days is like, wow. But if you got it, you got it. If you're still able to go on your vacation, then you're fine, you know? Like, I'm not, I'm not gonna make a spender feel bad as long as you're not, like, literally, like, you know, putting your home up and, like, <laughs> trying to refinance your house because of it. Yeah. You're fine, but hope your vacation goes well, though. My vacation is in a couple months, so um, I I still can't go crazy though, cause like I gotta we're gonna be buying a car, so I got stuff to get. Finally unlock Vidusa Mountains. Yeah, I gotta get that. I'm a mean, but right now I'm trying to uh. I'm trying to get back to playing this account. That way I can give y'all a guide on the Primal Lord. So yeah, I don't say I spend that much on HSR and after a while I got so bored and haven't played it since, so. HSR isn't as auto-friendly because you have to walk around every now and then and there's a story you have to listen to. So it's like for some people who just li like live a kind of busy life, where they just want something they can just pick up, spend their money, and go. Like, that's where the idle games do well. That's why people put so much money in it, because spenders can spend a lot of time in it, and they can spend money to keep playing it when they want to play it and just let it run on auto. That special looks really cool. Yeah, this is Scarlita. I just picked her up from the, uh, from the guild shop. I really like Scarlita. I'm really, I really like Scarlita. I enjoy this because I can relax and still get all my loot from AFK while I'm not on well the reason I ended up playing this so much yeah exactly right because you're not having to worry about stamina being forced to log in you can literally like uh if you have a busy day you know you can just log in once get all your rewards and be fine
That video is going really crazy right now. At least the best video I've had in a while. I gotta make. Oh, I gotta get another guide out. For Rainier is so OP. You use the attack speed artifact because it gives your units CPC immunity. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Because uh, the furthest back, and then you have them teleport, so they teleport over there. Yeah. Rainer's really good. I used Rainer in the beta because it gave us a free unit. Um, I think for, like, this account while trying to catch up in the AFK progress, I think Scarlita has just been helping a lot as well. Uh, I'm not saying Scarlita's better than Rainier. Uh, I just think that for this team, Scarlet has been working really well. Yeah. You just teeth them in the back. I still need eight, ten pools and I unlock stargazing. Been playing the game as much as I could. As a free play, I get stuck a lot. Yeah, you'll get you'll get stuck. But it's gonna be alright. Oh, you you got the stargaze station? Nice, nice, nice. As long as you're patient though, you can definitely do well in the game. If you're patient, you do everything you need, you make sure you get your progress, you invest in the right units, you'll be good. Build your teams up. Yeah, see so even people here, we're gonna go for bosses. Insanely good buffs and debuffs, yeah. Like Rainier is still gonna be like it's a really hard toss up. Rainier is really solid. Burial seems cool on paper, but like Burial just isn't really that one. But I am rank one on my server. It's just me and one other guy. That's in the 1 million power range ATM, but he went with Burial and I went with Rainier, so he beats me in PvP only. Yeah, uh, Burial is a PvP unit. That's about it. At least for now. Might as well slow it too. I had some dude with Max Burial join my corrupt creature team and the battle was so over so quickly. Well, I mean, a Mac, but like, see that. See, into something like that, though, like, at the point where you're at, Max Burial is a little, like, overkill. A, like, a Supreme Plus Burial is a little bit of overkill. But I'll, uh, I'll try to get, mm. I think I know, Dian like, Dianel needs buffs to be really good, so, like, I, I probably won't make a guide on Dianel just yet, um, like, with using him, but I'm gonna see if somebody gets him. Hey, if I get to watch some Lucky Lux gaming. Yo, what's good, bro? Uh... Yeah, I haven't streamed for a little bit. Was dealing with some personal stuff. But yeah, no, we've been live. We're definitely no turtle. Going live for 15 hours. I got kids, wife. I gotta make sure it's good. I can't stream like him. But yeah, it was good, bro. Right now, I'm just farming my PTR. Trying to get it back. Trying to get it back up to a good account. Even though I can't make up for all the lost time, I can still do some decent stuff with it. Wow. Yo, Hidden Insanity, thank you for the follow. I mean, you gotta do what you gotta do, respect. Yeah, appreciate it, man. Yo, we are 
blazing through these AFK stages. We were like 200 something. You got your Haywin Max and with the plus five, the damage reduction with her as well. Super nice for the campaign. Oh yeah, you probably just you'd be tanking most stuff with that. To be honest, being in the right guild is a huge help. Yes, being in the right guild. Like, well, see, Obi, that's why we are getting. That's why we're getting our, uh, our um celestial hippo so qu uh, quick. Jeez, I didn't realize how high your units were. This is my PTR. This is PTR. So, um, my my units are high level, but like, I I technically should be higher because this is an old account. Like I, uh, they reset the campaign and everything because the campaign was like a bunch of hamsters and you had to collect a bunch of fragments and stuff. I haven't done the new campaign on this account, so, like. They like reset uh, the campaign and made a lot of changes. Uh, public test realm server, basically. We're on server. Uh, my main one, the Lucky Guild, is on twenty-five. Yeah. Scarleta's really cool. Rainer's really good. I think Scarleta just, like, her animations look sick. Like, I, like, not gonna lie, her animations are crazy to me. And she's just up here, here shielding, helping out. Which I'm in my head, I'm like, that seems really good for my Thoran, right? Like that's what in my head I'm like, yo, you could be shielding my Thoran, and like we could be having a great time. Uh, like I know with Rainier I can teleport somebody back, but I don't have another front line yet. So, like. Wait, but with the daily login event that's going on, we're going to get one copy of every character in the game? Or is it just random? We'll get one copy of, I know all the epic characters, we'll get one copy uh, of, well, yeah, logging in, you'll eventually, you should eventually get most of the characters, I think. But like, I got a, um, I got a copy of somebody I already had. So I didn't get a, it's not like I got a copy of somebody whom I didn't. Right, so it doesn't really target. I think it's like a chance of getting most of the heroes. But yeah, it's like a, over the course of a long period of time. What's a decent arena team to climb with? Um, There's a couple um, a lot of them are using Thoran. You can use Thoran, Haywin, Aaron. Hold on. Oh, let me finish this. Like, there's a CC team with uh, Carolina, Aaron, Arden, Haywin, and uh. Thorin. And the reasons being like you have hella CC from this guy with like upgrades and stuff like that. But if you're early on, but if you're early on in free to play, we will make them pay. If you can get Thorin, Igor to be annoying, Cecia in the back. And then you can use your healer as Haywin, and then like your last DPS can be like, uh, 
whoever is going to be really good for you. If you don't have Haywin, you can use Smokey, of course, uh, and go with another. But, like, you can use Haywin with, like, Aeron or with uh, Brian. If you don't have Thoran, then, you know, you can go with Granny. And I guess if you have a high um, Kafra, but Thoran's just really sick. Thoran's the best, uh, Thoran's honestly, in my opinion, the best tank in the game, so. Um, it's really hard to suggest another tank, because he's just really good. I gotta delete some friends. They're really trying to get me. I'm about to get another one. I'm at 13. I just bought one today and I'm almost halfway. Might be able to get one. I feel like a broken record, but life without Thorin is rough. Yeah. So doing account reviews, uh, you can throw it up in the uh, chat. Um, I'll look at them while I'm doing some uh, I'll look at it while I'm doing some stuff. I don't think I've done these very well. Yeah. Bro. Uh, exclamation discord, throw it in, uh, AFK help. I love the lightning spell. The lightning spell is really good. Bro, I gotta do campaign with Scarlita, dude. Can you believe it? This is so like This is so wild. Why do they even have me doing this? I should be able to skip. Oh by the way, I got a question. I got my selection chest, but I already have three out of the four in my chest to so go for the last one. Yeah, Rowan or Igor. Bruce isn't like that crazy. Yeah, I put out a I put a video out. By the way, guys, I do put out um, AFK journey videos. I put one out for the selector. If you're debating on the selector, and I went over the characters. Um, I also uh, put out guides for each boss as well. Uh, put out guides for each boss as well, and those guides have helped out um, all of the whales in my guild be the top, uh, like, all the whales in my guild are literally top 10. Some of them are in the top five. So, they're really helpful, uh, is what I'm saying. I try to help as many people as I can. All right, let's look at this. Ooh, this, this guy went for the Vela. I see you got the Rowan. All right, so you got the tankiness from Haywin. I like that. Uh, I see your Antandra is pretty high, so you're probably with the Haywin given the damage reduction. You're probably got a really tanky Antandra, which she's shielding the person behind her, which is really interesting. And then you can literally swap in. You also have the high Rowan to swap in for the extra energy. And you probably went to Antandra, I'm guessing, maybe because, like, your Graveborn isn't as high and your Thorn's a little low. You also have Aeron for... Um, you're almost getting a wilder team together. So you seem really strong and wilder.
Yeah. You're like a wild or a light bringer, which is pretty good units. Like, if you got a crate, like, if you got, like, hella copies of Lucius, like, putting on Lucius and then, like, because you could do a team of, like, if you got hella copies of Lucius, you could literally take off Smokey, put on, uh, uh, Rowan, do Lucius, right? And then take out Odie. If you're doing PvE stages, you could take out Odie and uh, put in Muriel, Mirian, whatever, and do hella just ults. Because her ults pretty, hits pretty hard. Um, and with all that extra energy, Haven would be healing like crazy, doing damage reduction. Lucius for early to mid game, I know you're a little later. He's uh, pretty decent. Um, Just with all the extra energy. You have a lot of options is what I'm saying. Like, depending on what copies you go, you could, like, change it up. But you have, you have like, the sustain for sure. Like, your highest heroes, other than Vela, of course, is healers, which is really good. Are we winning the battle drills? Uh, we're second place. We got second place in the server. So we did really good. If we work, good morning. Let's yo, man, say good morning. It's eleven o'clock my time. But what's yeah? Yeah, we got second place in the server there. But what's good, bro? Here now, were you deep in your? Yo, tin pull, this is where the count turns around. Yo, it's good, Camilo. Come on, give me some. Yo! Yo! We got lucky. We got it early. Alright, well, I'll take that. We need one more copy for Legendary Plus. Yo, PTR account is turning around, bro. We gonna make a comeback. We in there. We in there, baby. Oh, I could've saved this. Anyways. Hold on. Now I'm curious. Reach resonance, resonance level 240. Okay, so my guild has done that. Cleared 45 levels of all Legend Trial tires. Oh my god. These fucking people. <laughs> 19 mil, 21. These are some accounts right here, bro. And the ones that are 2 million are probably the free to play ones.
21 mil? Yeah. That's what PTR is on, bro. It's, uh... It's a little on the ridiculous side, I know. So I was just saying, there's a uh, there's people who have spent enough money to buy a car. So don't don't feel too bad. General has asked me to protect you. Not that you need it. What is the highest power on your main account server? Uh I think we're they're in the three mils. Maybe going to four. I think it's like between three and four mil. Yeah. Something like that. It's 11 a.m. in Indonesia, bro. Honestly, if I was able to spend money, I'd just get the characters I like, then just chill and play. I mean, yeah, I would probably just hella focus on people I care about and go from there. I wouldn't really... Like, and what's crazy, though, is, like, more characters are going to come out. So, like, spending all of this now, when there's going to be crazier characters, would be, like, a little interesting. Because, like, I'd rather just go all for characters characters later right like for a new one because you can only get them with gems you know so like that's probably what i'm gonna do like the people who went all in on vela like vela is not new like i have vela on this account because she was literally like just a regular character she was not special in any way you get it in VIP 11? Okay. I'm kind of close to that. Um, but yeah. Yeah, I like Vela, but she isn't worth it in my opinion. Like, a lot of people who have her love her, but I don't think... I don't think she's worth for me to spend and get just her. I don't think she's... She doesn't quite do it for me, just personally. But she is a decent character, but, she, like, she's just not that one. Yeah. In the unyielding light, judge inventory, shipments, deliveries. Am I missing anything? Oh, yes. Gifts for my customers. Don't y'all be disrespecting baby girl like that. Wild and else server is like a few days older and it's that high. Yeah. Who is that one then? Wait, 21 all these burger servers? Yeah, these are PTR. This is a PTR. Uh, so this is before the game was live. This was like, hell, months before the game was live. I played this account like like, I should have been playing this account. This account was from, like, last year. Uh, like, December? So, maybe? Yeah, so. Oh my god. I get all the launch rewards too? 
Yo, free register rewards. I never got any of this. Damn. Yo. I just got another character. Oh, I can get another one. So now I can do a guide. Oh my gosh. Uh, yeah, my Discord should be in the description. It should be the right link. It's, uh, Discord. It can help. Uh, Vela? The Light Bearer ones? So you get Light Bearer ones from, uh, well, you know, you have your shop. You have... Hold on. You have your shop, and then you have your towers. It's just going to be um, a really big place, like your legend trials. So these right here, Towers of Light, those give you a good boost of your acorns there for your rewards. And then the Omni acorns help out a lot because um, the Epic Recruitment gives you those omni acorns but like pulls is a one of the better ways to get it see well, i'm stuck until my heroes are 100 now to go further in the campaign i just hit 90 during reset yeah it's gonna be a little rough there oh my god yeah there is 20 codes that's right bro this this is a bro this ptr account's about to catch up dog we about to catch up. Marilyn. All right, this should be an S level hero right here. No, okay, so next one. Those who know will. What's wrong with the goods? What's wrong with the goods? Double OD. All right, S over here. Whoa, bro. What are you hey, Lucky. Leave it to me. How do you exactly do you contribute more guild chests to guilds? I see people in guild with 400 actinists, but chests contributed is low or zero for some. Uh, so they did that on purpose. So in my guild, I put equal distribution because I've had people going in and out. Uh, some of them do it by, some of the guilds do it by um, whoever has the most, right? But that really only benefits people who can complete more things. And so people who are lower are going to get way less chest. I put it just as equal because, like, I don't need my whales getting more chest than the lower spenders and stuff like that. I actually talked to Turtle about it, and he agreed he was fine with that because, like, what's, like... In the guild, you gotta have your weakest link also get strong as well. So, yeah. Some guilds have it that way, where the top people get everything. Jesus, send it to me too. Yo, Big Daddy Benji, thank you for the sub. Wow, you didn't talk to me. It's all this art important, I see. Well... Turtle is, uh, only person I talked to was Turtle, um, about it, but, because <laughs> he's, uh, the sub-officer, he's the guild, um, leader, but nah, you're all important, it's our CEO right there, what exactly do you need to do to, to compute more chess, like the requirement, so it's all about, um, wow, okay, hold on. So, okay, so this isn't my guild. So you have completing these challenges here, right? 
Guild challenges can uh, consist of extra rewards. And then, like, so, me right here, I'm 490. And I've been the most active in this guild, actually. Wow, holy shit. Um, and this is a active ratio distribution. So there's two different distributions. Equal, chests will be distributed evenly among all members. Active ratio, chests will be distributed based on the members of weekly activeness. Players with higher activeness can receive more chests. Glory paint, glory points, ranking distribution, like that. So it's all going to be based off of how they set it for the weekly requirement. So you got to do all of these things here. You got to do all of your weekly missions to help with your um your activeness you said what yeah but you know the amount of chess each player contributed we see in the next tab yeah you're talking about this is this distributed amount Distributed amount right here. You talking about this one right here? Oh, 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 here we go. That's what you're talking about. Oh, this part here. Now, so I had the option as leader, there were 30 chests that we had uh, to distribute. And I was able to give out everybody an extra chest. And I guess um, some people gave chests. Now, I haven't seen this part, but I know it asked me as guild leader, like, yo, there's 30 extra. What do you want to do? And I just distributed 30 chests into the pot. What server am I on? My main server is S25. This is PTR6. Let me see. Hold on. Let me check. Let me look at my account real quick. My Well, my real account. Okay, mode rankings. Here we go. Okay, earn guild chests for your guild by achieving high ranks during corresponding tally of rankings. Which the guild I'm in on my PTR is rank 21, so they don't rank high, but we rank pretty high in this guild. Guild chests will be granted when all guild coin rewards are claimed from weekly guild quests, and the acquisition amount of guild chests is based on the quantity of active guild members from the last week. Guild chests will be distributed to all members based on rules every Sunday, which just happened for us, right? The guild leader can modify the, uh, the distribution. If a guild acquires over 1,200 chests in a week, they receive extra chests at the start of the next week. The guild leader can manually distribute these bonus chests to designated members. So, available guild chests from mode rankings, daily arena tally, top 5 champions, top 6... Like, so, we have a lot of our people that are in the top 100. We have some people who are in the top 6 to 20. I've been in the top 6 to 20. Weekly Arena, um, you have this tally here. So this is our tally, available good chest remote. So this is where we've tallied up everything. This is where you tally up everything here for the amount of chests. So, I mean, we've 
<laughs> We've gotten 850 chests. From, like, higher rankings. Alright, Obi. Since reaching AFK 300, he's gonna have to wait till later. So, yeah. And then, of the 850 chests, I distribute it, but we're waiting for... But we need some people... Ooh. To do their weeklies. Nakama. I gotta check with Nakama. Kodiak. Hey, Lucky House. This game. Game's doing good, bro. Uh, a lot of people from uh, my old games and the people playing R9 were all like playing it together. Uh, we've been, I've been liking it, bro. It's a, I mean, it's an idle game that passes the time between our other gotchas. So it's been really fun. Right? Yeah. So basically, Rukus, like, if you got a hella, like, okay, so yeah, I'll just be honest. If you got people who just aren't hitting these uh these top ranks then they're just not getting anything yeah you're just not getting extra chests you might be in a i mean just being honest you might just be in a guild who just isn't doing because these are a lot of like competitive leaderboards weekly honor duels weekly arcane labyrinth daily dream realm tally because like i'm usually in the top 100 for this so i get chests so, like and that's how, like, you know, these are the big time whales, and I'm like right behind because, like, I've been doing decent as well. But we have a lot of people who, like, I mean, this is a lot of chess. Now, there's a nut, like, there's other guilds, like, you know, Shadow, that's probably has a crap done as well. But yeah. Oh my god, this person is staring at it. Yeah, I gotta check with Nakama. Let's see if we can help out, Obi. You're not even worth getting up for. Oh, it's one of these stages. Mm. Sir Lucius, at your service. Potions for sale. Buy four, get one free. I've never used Atalanta. You're not even worth getting up for. Ooh, okay. Oh, is this dumb laser dude, bro? I did not like him. Yeah, okay. I did not like him. 
I'm the guild reader in my guild at S51. Managed to get rank three in the recent battle drills, but I recently noticed some players of Rajactinus to check to get the chest we have, but when I checked, they contributed zero. So I was wondering, it's a guild leader point of view. They don't respond to me and not contributing to our total chest. Is it wise to just let them go and let them leech off of others? <sighs> yeah, like um, I see, I see what you're talking about now. You're like. Basically, you're like, yo, I got, like, hella people who are, like, let's just be honest, lower rank, probably free to play, who aren't able to rank as high in these. So, do I get rid of them and get people who, because, like, you'd have to literally replace them with people who can rank high to contribute more chess, right? So, like, they have the activeness, but, like, yeah, like, if you're wanting to get more and more chess, then... You would have to, yeah, decide that. It depends on, like, uh, like, if the other half of your people are just, like, really, like, really good, and you feel like you have enough people in your server to add them, then do so. But, like, maybe after the first week, see how it's like. Because, uh, like, we only had, like, a few days for this first week. So, I mean, like... You can see how this first week goes. Because remember, a lot of people are going to drop off after a couple of days of playing the game because it takes up a lot of time. So some people will probably naturally drop off without you having to do much of anything, at least before the ranking, too. Like, people just, like, usually this first week, people drop off hella. As a leader, and you want your group to be competitive, and you can set standards as long as the expectations are clear. Yeah. But, like, also, like, limiting the power level of your guild is what a lot of people do, too. Like, if you're wanting to compete pretty heavy, limiting the power level is something you would do. I didn't really limit the power level of mine, because, like, we have spenders who make up for it, and we just, you know, we're just being helpful. But, like, that's another way to do it, too. I don't like this number. <laughs> but, yeah, you have to start as it. You have to start... Like, that's the thing, too, is, like, not starting with that, like, Iron Fist, like, makes it a little weird, because, like, people are like, yo, I thought I was good, and then, you know, they're like, oh, all of a sudden, I'm not good, so, you know, just be straight up with them, too. Like, just be straight up with your people. They'll, they might not like it, but, you know, at least you were being honest. Like, especially if you're trying to be competitive. Like, if you're really going for the game for the long run, you want to be competitive, yeah, it would be best to definitely set that standard. You know? Early on, too.
Okay, hold on, guys. All right, there we go. All right. Um, maxed out my DPM. All right, let's go do this. Are you a team in there? Can you help me with the proxy? I'm lost. Yeah. <laughs> bro, this man DG. No, bro. I'm just getting hella. Bro, I'm just getting messages, man. People be desperate to get in my guild. Like, like what's crazy? As soon as a person, like, I just messaged Jock, but like, as as soon as one of y'all, uh, like, don't log in for a little bit, bro. People gonna be like, "Hey, yo, bro. I see it's a, a a dude didn't log in for like six hours." Let me get into your let me get into your guild, bro. Like, bro, I got <laughs> I be getting people messaging me every day. You said I just need to chill. Can I feel like a fair day? <laughs> I literally be getting messages, man. They be that's why I just ask. I'm not trying to kick. I just, bro, people be like on my ass. So you say wrong. <laughs> <laughs> I was waiting for like, yeah. It's because of my skin color and it like man walking about. Did you quit? <laughs> Bro, it's I promise, man. Wait, simply just let me help me with proxy. And then a second later, never mind, figured it out. Man, I done swapped accounts and everything, bro. This guy. Uh Big Daddy Benji. Uh so this you? Ooh. Oh wow, you got Supreme. You got Mythic here. You got Rainier. Okay, well, so you either got really lucky or you went a little in on the banner, but you got one copy. All right, so uh, in terms of units, the ones that you have, you have really good ones, right? Thorin's gonna be one of the best tanks. Cecia is just really easy to upgrade because we already got a copy of her for free. Uh, so you got a couple copies of Vela um, and Rowan. Lucius is pretty good for early to mid, but eventually falls off um, later on, unless you keep getting copies of them. But there's just other better light bringers, right? Odie's gonna be one of the top DPSs for the Dream Realm, same as Merrily, so you have good investment there. Kruger is gonna be really good for the defense lower. Um, Coco down here, you wanna get her. Coco is literally the reason why most people are able to survive on Skyclops because she has a 45% damage reduction. You really want to slot in uh, Coco. Also, uh, in terms of healers, um, Rowan is good and probably at this level is keeping you alive. But like Haywin and Smokey are going to provide more healing than Rowan, right? So I would, I don't know if you have them focused or you just got really unlucky. I would work on them. Rainer's good for the bosses too, but Rainer's going to be low level for a while until you get another copy, right? So, um, and that's where you're at on Rainier because you seem like you've been progressing through the game pretty well. You're at 80, waiting for 81. But yeah, um, your Dream Realm characters is going to be like, Corin, Merrily, Kruger, they're going to be really good for doing, uh, and Odie. Uh, for progression, your Thorin, uh, Cecia, Carolina have a lot of CC with them. And then I typically like running either Haywin or Smokey right with that, because you could run a team with doing Thorin, Cecia. Haywin, Carolina, and Arden. And Arden can do the DPS. There's also a crazy team, too, with uh, Thoran. Thoran, Haywin, Arden, Carolina, and Aaron. What they have higher investment. They, it's just all CC, locks everything up, and it's really good on story progression. So you have the right units. Just, you know, keep investing into them. But the wilder units. Uh, and the Graveborn units are going to be really helpful as well. But good account, though. I got to work together, Doxy. He just made that eat ass to clean the house. Yes, Light Spinner, I've hit Rowan so much. I'm lucky with copies and the other two. Hey, bro, I mean, Rowan's pretty nice. 
But uh, the count looks good, though. You got a lot of characters. I would say, like, you know, try not to keep up with too many characters, but you're doing really good. Uh, yeah. I think it's... Wait, hold on. Did I not put it up? second yeah this here third one is really good and then I have a lot of information from PTR players Galita. Yeah, no problem. Wow. Yo, please say safe. Thank you for the follow. Appreciate you. Also, Lucky, I got into a top two guild on my server with the number one whale on the server. I've been top two for Dream Realm every day so far. Yo, yeah, when you're in a good guild, it allows you to progress really far. It really does. Need advice if I should start over? Exclamation Discord. Just drop a screenshot of your peeps and we'll look at it in AFK help. Drop it in AFK help. What a coincidence, man. I gotta drop. Oh my god. Yeah, I go through all of this. At least I get the pools and stuff then. Man, this story was all different. Okay, main court? No, 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 no. It's uh, my own Discord. Yeah, Coco just helped me get an extra one mil on Cyclops. Good luck, man. Hey, bro. I have a guide for all of the bosses on my YouTube. Um, I have a guide for every single boss. And I'm working on this account so I can get one for the uh, big boss. Um, the Primal Lord. So I'm, I'm trying my best to get y'all. So could you explain the combo you're using on questing by curiosity whenever you can? Uh, yeah, hold on. Now this one isn't necessarily, um, oh, no. This one's not necessarily a good example because this is a PTR account. But if I were to remove this unit, I'm running a faction buff right so that's giving me a big boost of power so for three members you get 10 percent for uh four members you get 18 percent, and then five members you get 22 percent. yeah i think it's supposed to be 10 14 18 22 yeah uh main thing i'm running lucius Rowan gives a shield. is just running around CCing. Valen likes having ult, so he's doing that. And I'm dropping down Scarlita. On my main account, I use Thorin with uh, Smoky. Thorin, Smoky with Cecia. And then I usually run like Coco or somebody for extra mitigation. 
right? I really like to go for... Uh, I really like to check my survivability first, make sure everyone survives. Then I go for damage, because sometimes I just run one DPS with AoE, like, you know, CC or somebody. Um, but usually, when my tank dies, the run is over. So I try to make sure that uh, tank is good. Um, if, like, you know, is like my main objective. And so if you have to bring in a second healer, sometimes you might have to do that. Or two tanks, right? It's definitely a viable option. The channel, please don't. <laughs> it's bad here, bro. <laughs> I know you're gonna mess with me for a while. Running two supports, one tank, marksman. Yeah, yeah. Typically, that's like what you gotta to go with. Come on, somebody join, please. Nobody's gonna be doing these, man. Cause like no one's at this rank, dog. Day seven, Breath of the Four, Magic under server average, AK Stage two sixty eight, Dream. Oh, this was. Please stay safe. You do have a lot of units. Um, you seem like you got a cop. Like the Coco is really good. The Smoky, the CC, the Thorin. Aaron's good. Uh, the CC, but you like, Aaron probably dies without the right. I mean, you have the Merrily, you have the Corin, and Odi for bosses and stuff like that. But your Thorin probably you would want more copies in because like he's probably dying for you a little much to use him. It's like, I mean, worst case scenario, like. <sighs> yeah, I see what you're saying if you should start over. Because the volley cop characters to get copies of, like, Aaron, like, he's cool. He's probably doing a lot, but, like.
I mean, I see the potential, but it depends on how patient you want to turn it around. But you'd have to get really lucky in your pools to hopefully get like more copies of your Thoran. That's really the one you need copies of is your Thoran to help keep him alive. But Coco helps him out too. And you do have the Haywin, so investing into the Haywin helps out for late game. But I would try to run a 3-2 split at least, so maybe... Yeah, maybe finding a way to run three of the fact same three of the faction. Well, all the copies of everyone last two days, Lego. Ooh. Didn't have said so, yes sir, but in AKC I'm pushing under ten K minimum, but I didn't learn that fourth day in. Miss Gilbox reward because I got it's my bad guild. But I'm missing one copy to Mythic. Pulled all of those Aerons. Nothing I can do to hold my dream. Top 100 chase for a resource. And they smoke and keep you everything alive. Running Aeron around smoked healing circle. Even that's hard to push now. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. It's going to be hard for that. I'm getting to. <laughs> oh my god, DG, bro. This man. <laughs> yeah. Oof. Yeah. I've been hearing, like, the guild. Like, the guild has really been messing people up with the chest. To just, like, help out. Yeah, Daddy Benji, thank you for the follow. Uh, thank you for the follow on uh, Twitch as well. Appreciate it. Yeah. Ooh. Yeah, because, like, it's either you do the slow route and you go under... Or you reset an account. Ravenger Guild is S40. So from the beginning, by inviting people for the donation and kicking them. Wow. That's messed up. Okay. Wow, that's crazy, bro. I can't do this corrupted creature. I got a gill that was victims revengers. Oh my god. Yeah, it's either you play the late game. I mean, you could always, like, keep your account and then just roll another one. But, like, I mean, you know, you missed the, the first week. So, like, you know, I mean, you have a bunch of, you have a bunch of, uh, um, codes that you could use, you know. But, yeah. They all whales in there. They hold up all the top 25 and all in dream hmm. what do you think about lucius atalanta coco vela rowan i think that rowan i i think that rowan can't keep up with heels after a good while personally i think rowan is like um i think rowan is good to be paired with another healer I don't think Rowan is healer main status. Yeah. He's only there for cooldown. Other than that, like, he's not... He's not a main healer. Smokey and Haywin are the main healers. And Haywin is really good for the end game Because of her, um... Reduction. Her mitigation.
No, Smokey beats her. Yes, Smokey does beat her in the um, buffing and healing. The only reason why I'm saying Haywin is because remember, Haywin does have that mitigation, which helps way into the late game. But we're not talking like right now. It's going to be a long time. It's just that don't forget about Haywin, is all I'm saying. Like, Haywin's going to be really, really helpful in those harder stages. Looking for me? Yeah, let me go ahead and get two copies of her. Hmm? What's up? I think I grew taller. Cause Merrily is good. Yeah, I wish I knew, knew what I do now. Not, I said, yeah, I wish I know what I do now. Not playing PTR, learning everything week one is rough. Yeah, I will say, um, like, even in the beta, like, people were just getting beat out because, like, PTR players just knew way more, right? Like, just knew way more. I mean, everyone heals themselves with Coco buff, with Rowan. Oh, I just realized, I just realized you had Coco. I didn't read everything that you said. I like Coco because of the drain buff on those fast marksmen. They stay alive for longer. Rowan for buffs. Yeah, 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 yeah. No, um, wow. sorry. I just saw that you had, um, free main game thing for the follow. I just saw that you had Coco. Yeah, Coco is really good for the survivability. Rowan can give you the energy to get that survivability and the little bit of a healing. That is something you can do. Um, if you find yourself, if you find yourself not having enough healing, then combine Smokey with, uh, Rowan instead, right? Run, run Smokey instead. But Coco is still really, really good, though. I run Coco if my tank is getting nuked, and I run that damage reduction. No, Coco cannot, in certain stages, Coco can't keep her own self alive. That's why, like... She also depends on energy too, which is which is hard. The only way I've been able to use Coco is like if I like you know. Well, I have heavy investment into Thorin to where Thorin stays alive. I can't go this way. Coco dies as well though. Coco doesn't work in every stage, but Coco is decent if you can get her to work. Oof, this is a lot of grinding. You're here. I hope there is no trouble on the road. Yeah, Haywin and Smokey are really good. Pushing season gate power under N29. On 299 stage, I learned the lesson to use them as side tanks. Oh, well, yeah, you're, yeah, fighting is under, you definitely need some side tanks, yeah. It's, it's, it's rough on some stages, bro. Because some of your tanks just take so much damage. Like, it's just like, bro, what is going on? Hmm. What a coincidence. 
What? <sighs> what unit should I get, man? I could get a copy of Scarlita, but like the problem is, is that in terms of like, in terms of like a guide, it would be nice to show the heroes, but like. I know people want to see. I know about Rainier, but I know people are deciding probably Is between Dino for me? Is there a feast? and Beriel, because they're not the most important. Greetings to you. That's why I know you legit. You look, just look at my account, you know my ruins dying and getting sidelined. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I see some people's accounts and they see my face and they're like, yeah, bro, I can tell by your face. Like, <laughs> you're just looking at it. I'd be like, oof, man. And like, my eyes be like, mm. <laughs> and like, all right. Because some people, like, sometimes AFK will really get you, like, you'll be, you'll pull a hero. And then every time you pull an epic, it's that same hero, and it's the wrong one you want, bro. You just keep pulling a dude back to back, and you're like, serious? To be able to know what they're talking about, and even advice. Yeah, this game, what sucks is that the wrong advice or talking about the wrong characters can. It, it does have long-lasting effects. I will say that. It does have long-lasting effects in this game. It's really rough. Bro, the smart thing to do would get a copy of Scarlita. In the unyielding light, judgment's arrival is imminent. Get an execution in Legendary Plus. The smart thing to do would get a copy. If I was trying to progress this account, the guide thing did what? Like, who? Ding dong! Surprise! Greetings to you. Hmm. I don't know what I should do. I don't know if I should get the character. For the content. Or get... I mean, I don't really... Mm. I already have... See? Perfect. So I already have footage of Rainier. So I can already make a Rainier guide. Because I already have content. I mean, I already have playtime. I already have footage and everything like that of Rainier. I don't have footage of Diano, and I don't have footage of Biriel. Surprise! Greetings to you. I'm sitting here trying to think, like, of the two, who should I get? My friend is playing with me. That's a weird combo in AFK stage that he was beating 10k powers just before. Was higher than him using two tanks, two supports, one marksman. I was like, how can it be? Of course, he got to a point where it didn't work anymore. Yeah, because like, and a lot of times if you don't heal your tank, you die. Like if you can't keep your front line alive, like that's why people run like hella sustain with the one, like it's just over for you. People having Dino because I think there's a data leak. Is other half a phoenix or something? Oh, okay. There's a lot of coverage of Burial and Rainy. Well, like Dino is like really good, like with uh, definitely investment in stuff, but but he needs buffers, and I don't really have a team made for him, right? Because like he needs. 
non permanent stat boost from an ally. This is a hard decision. Because Burial, like... I mean, Burial isn't the greatest. I mean, there's always, like... I'm literally going to be getting... One of these anyways. So... So I guess it's up to me on... Who is the... Should have worked with Coco's buff. Yeah. Yeah, actually. Coco gets the damage reduction buff. And the uh, life drain buff. I think Arm is. Uh, hold on. Because Diana looks cool. And I know people know about Rainier already. That's all people talk about right here in Dream. Yeah, but see, like, I'm not worried about Dream Roam from this account. I'm just trying to get him. Uh... Uh, I'm just questioning on artifacts. Do you really get all the stats of the artifacts you own? Yes, artifacts are huge. Artifacts are huge. Yes, you do. Artifacts provide so much. Yo, Harrison, for the sub. Rainier, uh, and the reason why Rainier is really good is because Rainier does HP percent damage. So it's really good on bosses. But I'm not really worried about I'm not worried about bosses on my PTR account. You know why? Because um I can't hit top 100 anyways. Like Like bro, the like this is the PTR account. People have like 90 million power, right? So this is purely for just pushing through stages. Yeah, artifacts is how people push 20k power under stages. Yeah. They are huge. All right, so I can't do any of these leaderboard content, so it's purely for like pushing, pushing stuff, and so I'm trying to think like, I think I'm gonna get Dianel. Scarlet copy is the best way to go, but I'm gonna get Dianel. That way I can make a video on him. Come. 
take with me. There we go. And I'll get one again eventually. His burial is kind of bad. <laughs> Especially like early on. Rainier is like really good. It's just like I said, I wanted to try something different. Where are my lines at? Anyone up for a drink? Bro, he's so cool. Okay. Okay, he's a little funny. Okay, that's a little silly, but yeah. I think I'm gonna go Rayfrey and Scarlet. I like her too much to not get her, but I, I do want to have some sort of progress in Dream Moon before it's possible. Before it's impossible, yeah. No, trust me, I understand. Bro, Scarlet just be up there. Gotta push the story. A perfect battle with a glorious victory. <sighs> We've arrived. Scene. Ooh, I'm getting tired. Me do a bit of these so I can make better progress. Lyca works with him too. Bro, what is Rowan doing? Yeah, okay, so he's not, he doesn't feel crazy. Air condition, what power I should be on the first seven days. I know day seven numbers. Just not sure what day one is attainable because I was global first time around. Um, let me see. Hmm. 
Hmm. I can show you what a lot of my day one account, well, a lot of the day one accounts in my guild look like. Uh, from free to play to low spender range, you can kind of see. Because, like, day one progress for a lot of people is different. Plus, like, we have a high guild, so I know, like, not everything's the same. But, like, For the low spender, yeah, after this first week, everyone's between three and four hundred thousand. Which Yeah. And these are like free to play low spenders. If they spent like five dollars or so, they're between like four hundred and like five hundred thousand. People who spent like, you know, under a hundred or because like my account is a two hundred dollar account. And I'm sitting and I, I can probably still push more. Um that's where I'm at. The accounts up here are you know, <laughs> they're up there. <laughs> but yeah. So Zebo is free to play for YouTube. It's 451 on day seven. Dang, man. He must have had crazy luck, though. I don't, I feel like that's outside of the norm. That's a crazy amount of luck. Like, getting just the right characters. Like, I'm not saying it's not possible, but, like, that's a crazy amount of luck. I've been thinking of starting a new account on a first server and not using my gyms just to take it to summon, but that... But that way, it'd take months to unlock Stargates. I'm very tempted, though. I'm in Jockey's Guild. I spent under 50, and I'm 800k. You got Supreme, Vala, and Mythic CC up pretty early. Yeah. And just snowball. Yeah. I feel like for a lot of people, like, if you get everything early, you can snowball. Day one to three, you do it wrong. Not pushing AK stage far enough. You fall behind fast because essence is capped on 5-7. Yeah. You do have to. You do get capped on that essence pretty heavy. And that's what sets you behind. But you gotta get like, you gotta, your pools have to focus into a couple too. Like, that's the thing is like, if your pools start going all over the place, then it's gonna suck. Wow! Calorie surplus, yeah, was good. Thank you for the follow. Like, that hero essence, that hero essence kills it, bro. I wonder if I can absolutely have to try this. I've never had tastier bread in my life. Missing one chest in Dark Four Seven. I have no clue where it is. Is it in a Yeah, you should be able to check the map. It might be in a cave or something. Can I log into my other account while being logged into this one? Because they're different characters. Oh, I can. Perfect. Let's 
Stuck means you can't clear a stage. 10k power under. That is unacceptable to me now. Yo, Tyler 1027, thank you for the follow. Yeah, and what's crazy too is that like um How many how many guild coins do you have? Uh stay safe. How many guild coins do you have? Hardly any. Yeah, see, that's what's going to suck, too. Because we're at 20... 23, 24k. So, like, literally next week, my guild, like, during this week, I think most of my guild members, by the end of the week, should have one of them. Which is, like, kind of huge. Yeah, like this account here, I'm trying to get it up because um, I have a lot to play, but I'm behind. There's Obi-Wan's account. 752. Um, I gotta. I'm trying to get the um, guide out for the primal. Tired friend. I know you've been working hard. Tell me, have you made any new discoveries? Am I playing beta? Uh PTR right now. Uh the game is out. I'm playing my PTR account, trying to uh catch it up. I haven't played it in a while. Oh, wow. Okay. Yeah. You got the 10k gems. That's wild, bro. Public test realm. It's basically like the test service. This man got the 9. Yeah, that's a... That's... Yeah, you had some crazy luck. Yeah. Yeah. Um, I'm just running this. Okay, anyways. Bro, Dinell's voice lines. I don't know if I can do this. This man's voice lines are <laughs> the sweetest. <laughs> like, bro. <laughs> lady Vala, it's been quite difficult to get a meeting with you, my lady.
Nah, you can definitely play sages under you. It's just uh, you gotta have that survivability. Bro, I just got two more messages. People trying to get in. Guys, if I had space, I would invite you. Everyone's... So many people on the server are trying to get in. Have you finished speaking to the mystery? You can act a group of minds to make it easier. I build my guild through my Discord helping people create stages. Yeah. The slot level can affect the outcomes and crits. Am I gonna play Astronite to Veda X? I've been seeing that game uh talked about. I haven't really looked at it. I'm gonna look at it. When does it come out, if you don't mind? When does that one come out? Do I have today? Oh my god. <laughs> I should have said Vader. Let's see. out today they have a steam launcher um okay so i should make an account now in the background i can stream. uh i can stream it tomorrow just on twitch yo it's good yeah doing a late night Trying to farm some stuff. But what's good, Darius? How you been, bro?
I repeat, do not delete. Account stays locked. Let's see. Oh, wait. Hold on. Emulator is blocked. You can't play on that. You gotta open game from a folder, not on Steam. Don't use if you want to reroll. If we do not. Okay. I'll probably just play it. But as you see... Uh... When is reset? Do you know when reset is? So that way I can make my account. I gotta make a video. Bro, they already got her kit out. I mean, I guess it's a week. Oh my god. Okay, so she's gonna be sick. Okay. Sorry, this is another game. This is another game. Oh my god, bro. Apparently they gave us a lot of problems. The bad reason. I have to look at it. But yo, what's good, cocky? Who the heck are you? This place ain't safe. Uh, we're playing AFK Journey right now. Make an account for what game? And I'm E3, about to be E4 on Acheron. Oh my god, bro, you putting in all your money. There are too many guards. Talking about Astro Knights of Veda. It's another game. You actually only came out. This man about to be E4 on Acheron. Woo! Twelve nineteen. Is it mobile? Uh, I think it's. They said it's mo uh, I think it's mobile, but like, um, it also has a Steam launcher. With our limited resources, the can you tell me the best budget team for Skyclops? Tyler, um, I do have a video on my YouTube. Uh, if you want to look at it further, right? Because I go over it. Uh, but hold on. Yeah, I gotta see. Yeah, there's. I haven't looked at it yet. So for Skyclops, the main part of, uh, of course, of course, the main part of survival, right, is like, uh, Coco gives a forty-five percent damage reduction. Huge. Uh, everybody in my guild pretty much has been able to get higher ranked on this boss because of Coco providing all of that. So Coco is going to be the best option for you. Um, healer, Haywin or Smokey are going to be honestly the better healing options for you. And then uh, for tank, you can use uh, Granny, Boran, anybody like that. Um, if you don't have that, then you can use your Antandra or your Lucius, if that's all you got. Um, and then in terms of range, GPS, Cecia or Odie or Merrily are going to be really good for you. Alright, now I'm about to attempt this, though, with non-friendly units, so... I wonder if no. Sir Lucius, at your service. Yeah. 
Yo, what's good, Doctor? But yeah, like if you're free to playing. The main thing about this is surviving that um, I beam. And Coco is the best, like, uh, elite option. She helps survive. Testing out comps for this boss? No, uh, well, y y I guess you could kind of say, but, like, this is my PTR. It's a low rarity. I mean, it's a low um, investment account. I'm just looking at these two celestial characters that I got on it. But I'm definitely not gonna rank. Yo, Larswing. Uh, Larswing, thank you for the follow. Yeah, it doesn't do near as much damage as I need. He did. <laughs> so, like, I got Dino, like, for the video, but, like, bro. Dino, like, just isn't. Yeah, without his buffs and stuff, he just isn't strong. Which, like, I already knew that, but I really wanted to see it on an account I can waste it on. And Dino just isn't the pick. Dino is definitely a pick, like, if you got something to waste, but he is not the pick for you guys. You need a team for him. Hmm. Strange. Take a look at those two guards. Don't their helmets look a little different hmm. from the other? Hmm. That's the... Dang. Bro, y'all telling me the game is bad, man. I'm about to look at it. I'll give it a... I'll give it a look. But, like, you know, I don't have to be serious about it. You can definitely give it a look, though. Okay. Everywhere for you. P -p Peggy? I'll be chilling tomorrow. I need to, I need to get some rest. Ooh, I'm pushing, I'm pushing on my main account right now. Yeah, you can't. You can buy tries for uh, coins, up to ten. It's up to ten. Figure hand sword. Team is Odie, Sissy, Smokey, and Thorin. Thorin's best thing to use. Yes. It's like between Brutus and Kruger. Uh, Kruger gives a bigger debuff. Yeah, but he has to stay alive though. Like he's saying, Kruger. Kruger uh, struggles to stay alive uh, before he gets his shield. I think it's Mythic Plus um, for the survivability. Other than that, Brutus will stay alive longer than Kruger. Yeah, Kruger gets melted, bro. <laughs> Kruger gets melted if you don't have investment. Like, he's a top unit, but, like, it, it takes so much. And the problem is, the problem I have with Kruger, like, so one as a content creator, everyone's like, yo, bro, you got to get this unit. But you're investing into a unit that's only good for Dream Realm. Like, and it's not great for everybody to do that. Like... It's really not great for everyone to just dress, like, just get a unit for Dream Realm and to not be able to use it. Because you're already getting Odie for that. 
you know, people are getting merrily, Corin and stuff like that, but they don't really help with, like, progress for everything. And I'm not saying they're not, like, but, uh, well, Kruger is just not good um, in much of anything, but it just makes it hard. It's not like HP is like a gas station. <laughs> Dude, faster than Coco 2 hits, he's out. <laughs> Finally got past AFK 285. Igor is a pain. Igor is very annoying. Hopping between. He like literally just delays stuff. That's all he's there for is just delaying. Lux, do you think Velo go to standard? Uh, I think so, because, like, before they put her on her banner, she was standard. I have her on this account, and I pulled her in standard. I think so. She wasn't a special character in the PTR. I know they changed things, but she was not special. She was literally just a character. That's what was making it weird. Ten pull. Ah, see what we can get. Coco and Arden. Someone call for me. Is there a feast? <laughs> bro, this dude is too much. This dude is too much, bro. This dude makes me like, like this dude is funny. Alright. I think I'm gonna let this. Lex, do you think Vela would go to, uh, wait, the mermaid girl is really broken. I think Mark is best support. Yeah, I'm at to look at it, but I gotta get some sleep, bro. So, I don't understand how people have mythic and stuff. I've bought all three passes and literally don't have a legendary plus. I don't know if I just have alpha pulls or what. Yeah, uh, you basically didn't get focused pulls, if you want me to be honest. Your pulls were kind of like, um, I guess you would say like, 
not lucky in getting the same one because you really want to get the same people. Because, like, uh, I have all the passes and stuff like that, and I got a Supreme character, and I have the Supreme Plus. I have a Supreme Plus and a Supreme character. I'll tell you that. Is it just me or I can't find one small chest in Dark Force 5? I already checked but still couldn't find it. Is it uh, in a cave maybe? It should show on the map. Can't start over though because you spent money. Yeah. You gotta, uh, I guess. You guys get lucky. There is a selector from the seven day login. Um, but like, yeah, but you at least can be on the leaderboard though, since you spent money. Yeah, like you said, man, leaderboard. Oh, I got the mountains. Well, just leaderboards, period. You should... You should be doing decent on leaderboards, right? Do you spend gems for the two resets for, for two hours of AK loot? Yes, I do. I was correct, memory girl with support and healer. Oh, I knew you should be support. I still haven't been wrong yet, so don't worry. I haven't been wrong yet. If the girl, if uh, Wind Song ends up not being a star reality character, then I do. Then I do a giveaway, but I think I'm gonna be good though. I think I, I think I'm a win. The sweetest taste. Yeah, the artifacts in the shop give you lots of power. Those give you uh, passive stats. They're really good. They boost your power quite a bit, like a lot. I think it was pepper. There goes Alex. Wow. Someone buys you like oh, we're not actually it says right. Do you think Daniel Fiscari is a good combo for more in-game related content? No. Dylanel is a. Uh, Dianel takes a lot of investment and he's a very specific buffer. I'm I specifically got Dianel for content. That way I can make a guide to talk to people about Dianel. He is not the move. I could probably use like a way better I could use a way better character uh than Dianel. Like he's cool and he's a celestial and I have this effect but like it's not the move. Scarlita, 
it's good. Rainier is really good for for bosses and stages just because of what Rainier does. It's really to having the helping with survivability and helping with like you know CC, but no. It's literally between Dianel and Scarleta. Burial and uh and uh yeah, Rainier and Scarleta are the ones. Dianel and Burial are just kind of lacking, bro. Both artifacts, yes, are worth getting. So it's not worth the investment at all. Uh, if you're a spender and you can get uh, copies of him, yes. But like, as in something you would select, like to get one copy of, no. He's not a good one copy, like character. Rainier is a good one copy character. Donnell, you need to get multiple copies of, and you need a specific buffer to give him attack speed buff like Leica or anyone who can give him attack speed and buffs like that constantly, right? So you need some setup with him. He's good. He is good for late game story. Don't get me wrong. He is good. Um, but he's not the best pick. Like right now, early on, he's not the best pick. Think Bunny Guy is next to the Vela? That would be nice, because yeah, he's been in the story. Uh, you can run. You can run Leica with him. Right, because Leica gives the attack speed buff, which is going to be really helpful uh, to help him out. And like Smokey gives a buff as well. It's so, like let's so if we were to do some. I need a tank though. I come to protect. And then like Cuz I know I know Parissa gives a buff too.
Yeah, Parissa increases attack speed and for herself in one year's out. So Parissa is also one too. I was like trying to remember. Yeah. Go ahead and just scroll, yeah. Go something like this, so you get all these buffs, right? So he's getting hella buffed. Now he's getting his. Now he's doing a lot. And he's getting his stacks, so you see these wings like that. Like, that's where he's getting his stacks, and he did a shit ton of more damage. So it's not that you, like, can't do it. You know, you just got to run a specific setup. But I also have Scarlita to help out, like, you know, uh, with the team. But, yeah. You know. Like, like if you can... Like, it's just something you can do. But Scar uh, Rainier is still, like, better. But if you really like Dino, like, if you really like him, then, like, yeah. Yo, Tim Jimmy, thank you for the follow. That's actually really cool, though. But... Anyways. Back to our... Sir Lucius, at your service. Potions for sale. Buy four, get one free. Who else needs a little pick-me-up? Oh my gosh, girl. She survives because you know. It does look like Scarlet is a good teammate to ensure he survives early on. Oh, we're hitting a. Okay, we're we're a little we're in a little bit of a struggle. Scarleta gives shields, yes. Scarleta gives hella shields. She's literally the only reason why I'm pushing these stages so far. But then, Valen just kind of came in a wreck shop. Yeah. Dino's cool, though. My shield is and his shots pierce, so he's, like, always hitting people. So, like, like he's just always piercing multiple. He's so cool. He's only a healer, more than one copy, sadly. But, uh, guys, I gotta go to bed. I gotta just push this tomorrow. I'll be streaming tomorrow. Oh. 
I gotta wake up for my kids. I hate that I can't push this even further, but I could literally keep going. But I gotta go to bed. Thanks for the advice. Yeah, no problem, man. Glad I can help. Yo, we got up to 40 viewers today, though. Yo, if you're not following the channel, please follow me, guys. Um, I have a YouTube channel, put out guides, be streaming this game. I usually don't stream this late, but please follow me up. Uh, I think a lot of y'all are going to like this account. So this is my PTR account, so I'm going to play it. It's not money uh, put into it. It's literally a $1 account, but uh, just I had a little advantage of starting earlier. So, you know, nothing here is too crazy. You see, I don't have a lot of Supremes and all of that stuff. This is this is literally like a terrible account, but I have like someone call for me? Celestials, so it doesn't make it any better, right? Uh, it's, <laughs> Imagine a free-to-play account with Celestials is what this account is like. But all right, guys, you have a good one. And I'm going to go ahead and get out of here.